not a lot of things go together better than fishing and drinking a beer. So we're going to do that. Kyla's here, but she's not on the microphone. So, uh, yeah, you can hear echoing from across the room. And we're going to see what we can catch. Wait a second. This is New England. Whose idea was it to go to New England? What's up, Hatcha? Let's go down a little Bible. Cracking right off the bat. If it just felt like the proper thing to do. What's up, Psycho? Have you guys, have you guys gotten back out fishing since we went? Kyla, talk louder. Hi! <laughs> the, you are so far away. Oh my god, rules? Where did those come from? That has nothing to do with today. Don't mind that. You were first, John? Appreciate you jumping in. Trial season starts on Saturday and I'm hyped. I am definitely not going on Saturday because it's going to be too crowded. However, I will be getting out soon after that. So we're just going to yeet this sucker out here and see what we catch. At some point, we're probably going to do a couple of the challenges here. And then, I don't know, an hour in, something like that, we'll go and try to catch some of the legendaries. Maybe all the legendaries. It's um, Goldstein, I don't know the name of the brown trout, and Henrik. So kind of the easy ones to catch. You have every African fish diamond. I feel like, is your name the same in Discord, like in the official, the angler Discord? I feel like I've maybe seen your post. I'm pretty sure I still, like I have two, but they're both tiger fish. I'm pretty sure I still haven't caught any other diamonds. Couple of decent golds, nothing out of this lake apparently happening right now. But maybe today we can change that. Didn't do a good enough job to get invited back? Yep. You, uh, you outfished us both. <laughs> Therefore, you're never being invited back. Alright, maybe we're gonna try something completely different here. What do I have on this? A red worm? What size hook? I have not gotten to fish for a couple of days. Actually, it's been maybe since the last stream. So we'll try this. Did you hear about the dig trade? I did. It's kind of crazy when you, uh, when you see... There was a, a big, like, slashing of his contract, too, so he's basically going to be able to be a free agent after this year. The compensation and just the way everything went, it, it isn't, I think, what a lot of people would have expected. Sounds good, Danny. I appreciate it. Hardest was the catfish. It broke me off twice. Is there a better bottom fishing rod than this one, the, like, 44-pound one or whatever? Because I know, like, it is capable... Of catching, you know, even stuff as big as, uh, what's his name, Sidewinder, but it's kind of difficult. Such a grind getting all the diamonds on this map, I can imagine. I don't know if I'll ever attempt to grind to get all the diamonds, but I would like to at least get some, you know, the ones that I'm more interested in targeting. Things like maybe the, the sharp tooth catfish. Um, I really want a diamond spotted bass. Kyle, you got one, right? Like a 10-ish pounder or something like that? Over by my tiger fish spot, and I have yet to get a gold spotted bass out of there. Fishing with the same stuff, of course. Gun hubs lurking sounds good. I should make a lurk command for YouTube. I don't know why we don't have that. There's the Centro del Rey from the souvenir shop on Spain. It can hold 66 pound line. That might have been the one people were telling me about. I wonder how big of a grind that is, like gold and diamond tokens and stuff. I wish I liked Spain more. What is this? Ah, oh, Muggle. Wouldn't have guessed that we'd catch a bronze that only weighs a pound on a size 6 hook. Alright, well let's go maybe up to 4 then? I don't even know if I have a silver Muggle. I must. I'd like a gold one of them. Thoughts on the next reserve for Call of the Wild? I honestly don't have like a, a good feeling as to what it might be. I feel like a lot of times... You know, maybe it helped when they would go back and forth like North America map and then, you know, the next one might be Europe and then back to NA again. Now with just the pattern and stuff and the fact that it's looking like we're going to end up having a year between maps, I, I don't know what to expect anymore. I bet you that is not a muggle. Never had any luck at any of the tiger fish spots for spotted bass. The spotted bass pond has been the best for me. Okay, so what is the spotted bass pond? Oh, it's the same one as the grass carp spot, right? Well, no wonder I haven't caught any grass carp out of there. <laughs> Terrible. 
How kind, Psycho. What is this? Oh, baby carp, speaking of. Maybe not the best spot to fish then if we're going to catch them. Well, I guess we'll go to the, the bass pond. Go and give that a try. Need to finish tying flies, making... I don't even know how to pronounce that. Pertigons and green weenies? Green weenies are the ultimate nymph, and anybody that fly fishes that disagrees is incorrect. When in doubt, bass pond. The only thing I wish is if you could have a boat there, because I feel like there's... Like, that deepest chunk of the pond is kind of hard to reach. Pronounce it exactly right, what are the odds? Pink eggs are excellent too. I have done pretty good on pink and orange eggs. I cannot lie. He's just a weenie in general. <laughs> a fly tie and weenie. I think we said this last time, but they need to add fly fishing to this game. Imagine catching like a diamond rainbow, like a 20 pound rainbow on a fly. My prediction is they'll add fly fishing with an Alaskan reserve. That would be the place to do it, in my opinion. Because not only does that get you multiple, like, I'm going to say cool locations and species to fly fish for, you've also got that ability to add, like, really big salmon that I, I think what we have now, I mean, it's the Atlantic salmon and we have kokanees. There's a, a bit of untapped, largely sought after fish species there. New to the game, what should I do? Like, literally brand new to the game? The first thing I'd recommend is doing, like, the tutorials and kind of learning how to use the different rods and stuff. If you're beyond that, I guess I'll, I'll wait for your answer and we can try to go from there. All right. Seems seems this is a steep drop-off. We'll try a popper first and see how that does. Pronounce it like Kokani just to annoy Mistress. Is she here? Those salmon have many a name in this community. I uh, bought the angler two days ago and I'm loving it, but I'm having a problem with the swim bait technique and frame drops. Let me look at a swim bait because I'm a little confused as you what, as like what you can mean by that. Frame drops, I mean, are you on console or are, are you on PC? Because if you're on PC, you can adjust graphic settings and stuff. I'm imagining on console, you're kind of just stuck. Hopefully she watches the VOD. Just, uh, when we go to Golden Ridge to try to catch Goldstein, we'll catch some Kokanis. No spotted bass. Should I be, like, float fishing or something? Maybe I should fish along the bank? Hardest find was the spotted bass and the Moggul? I feel like, for most of the fish, at least that I have any interest in, which is most of them on this map, to be fair, carp I really don't care about as much. I don't feel like I have a good carp spot. Necessarily minus that gr grass carp pond, which I had wrong anyway. Um, I don't have a clue for Moggle. Like, I, I've caught some silvers and bronzes in some places, but I don't even have a guess where I would try to go. Console frame drops can be fixed by fast traveling. What in the world? It, like, I guess that's deloading some assets or something? I can't imagine why that would be. I'll be playing Fishing Planet because $45 is wild? $45? Is it that expensive? Why is it 45? Oh, maybe. Maybe the big bundle that could be. What's up, Lucky? Just going fishing. There's a Moggle Diamond Hotspot that Pro XDK showed on YouTube. Fair enough. Might have to check that out. Don't ask me why it works, but it does. Maybe Beagle with his immense wisdom can tell us what's going on there. How many diamonds have you got total in the game? If you don't count the broken golden trout when they came out, because I caught like at least 10 of those. It's not like I was trying to get diamond golden trout either. I just liked fishing for trout and they kept biting. Uh, like four? <laughs> no, wait. Yeah, four. I had a diamond largemouth. I had a diamond rainbow trout. Still kind of my most proud diamond. And then the two diamond tigerfish. It was on early access, so it technically doesn't count, but I'm pretty sure I still have the biggest diamond tiger fish 
which is really dumb because, you know, I have four diamonds. Fast traveling, I'm sure, flushes the frame buffer and rendering pipeline. Yeah, see, that's what I was thinking, but I wanted you to say it first. Uh, yeah, like uh, Muskelunge said. Good name, by the way. Blocktail and the 8th. I've got a really fun video coming this weekend, by the way. It's, um... I don't want to spoil too much. But... There's some... Not exactly the Hunter Classic aspects that are going to be included in this video. What, level? 53 or something? Alright. What bait will a bass hit? Because this clearly isn't working. See, I bet you I don't have them. I was thinking eggs. Bear bass. Am I blind? Oh, but they'll hit redworm too. Weird, because I kind of feel like I try that a lot and don't catch anything. So, got the wrong size hook. What's the minimum for... Do it. Eh. Three might be kind of big. We'll start with a five. The problem having with the swim bait is I'm just kind of slow in the head and don't know how to properly reel it. I'm pretty sure the swim bait is just, like, non-stop retrieval. Do I have one? I don't really use them. Where do I even look? Swim bait. Stop and go, constant, or twitching. So really, you can just do constant. But, well, I don't know how it works. On console, is there a button that you can hit to do like the, the different types of retrievals like you can on PC? I'm imagining so, but I've never played with the controller. Try throwing a six red room as far as you can. I ended up just pushing a boat all the way to the pond. You pushed a boat here? From where? Get out of here. You're not allowed to catch the fish that I'm trying to catch. Like from there? What's up, Maximus? Try throwing a six red worm. Hey, that guy got a gold catfish. I will give it a try. Wait. Oh, I was looking for hook size 6, and I couldn't find it. So I just assumed I had it on the other rod. So, like... Huh! If I had a better rod, I could probably... You know what would work, though? If we went around to the left, we could let the current kind of take it out. It's sort of going to go further, but not as much as I'd want. You hold the buttons. What's up, JTAC? I would... Okay. <laughs> Read in the chat. I would hope so, Ace Pilot. You can push a John boat all the way from the boat dock where you got your tiger fish. Bunch of people are doing that? I guess that is how that guy got there. Hey, uh, hey, Jimmery. I need help. I'm gonna go do it. Oh, you again. Hey, I saw you killed a 194 blacktail, huh? It's a good looking bass. Alright, good start. I think I'm going to push a boat. How, how, two questions. Do I use my feet or do I use like a vehicle? PB but ain't going to tax it? Why? 194 is solid. What's it going to hurt? Takes about five minutes if you're a professional boat pusher. Feet. Gotcha. Five minutes is longer than I was hoping this would take, but I'm willing to give it a try. It's a button to press, I think it's triangle, but I'm not getting any fish. What, do you know what hook size you have? My guess would be if you're not catching like literally anything and if you're in a spot where there's fish that are attracted to a swim bait, you've probably got too big of a hook size. I'm good, Ash Wolf, how about you? I did my adulting activities today. I went and got my uh, taxes done and all that. Oh wait. Is up the hill going to be a problem? Oh, you'll have to push it up a hill. Have fun and good luck. 
See, I feel like this isn't going to go well. I'm going to try the Jeep, but I'm betting I'm not the first person to think of that. Oh. Follow up. I'm going to have to go at least some distance on foot because <laughs> it kind of spawns in the water. Those things you have to do every year? Yeah, those things that the government knows how much money you made, but they won't tell you how much money you made, so you have to figure out how much money you have to pay in taxes, and if you get it wrong, then you can be put in jail. It's great. A very sensible system we have. So wait, the Jeep seems like, wait, the Hunter has the Jeep, we need a Jeep as well? This doesn't look horrible. On the boat? What the? That's not fair, man. That guy just hates me, I guess. Why? Stop doing this game. Why does it put me in the boat? Like, I'm actually not... I'm not hitting anything. It's just... <laughs> I'm gonna try the Jeep. I bet it won't do anything. Is that have fun? Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm beginning to question how much fun this is gonna be, actually. Don't slide down the hill. Oh, good, you drive through it. It's like a fun little minigame. I like how you put air quotes around fun. No. Just cut, I... <laughs> I'm about to just go back to fishing along the shore. <laughs> go up. This is working so well. Everybody's doing the boat thing? Yeah, and then Kyla just gets a free ride. Went over there and... No! Okay, I'm gonna fish from the shore. How about that? Uh, that was great. Need an airboat? I need... Something that will actually work. It's the worst part of pushing a boat. Like, I like that they programmed it so if you, like, say, jump into the boat off the dock or whatever, it just puts you in the seat to pilot the boat. It's a smart way they did it. Though, if you're at all above the boat, it seems to cause that issue where you end up just in the boat. So here's what, here's my thought. Uh, the currents kind of flow in sort of like... Crossed. So if we start from over here and then just open the bale up, it should float to the deepest part of the lake. If you weren't so small, you'd carry it. Not wrong. They don't have an inflatable raft yet? That'd be a good idea, actually. Maybe something that takes up some percentage of your, uh, your backpack. Better watch out. In 15 years, my float's gonna be over to where you guys are at. What's up, Colin? Big man's in here as well. Uh, IRL turkey hunting this year? Indeed, I'm gonna be heading to Kentucky here uh, next week. And then I get to wait. I guess by the time I get back, still over two weeks, I think? Is it three full weeks? Ours opens May 4th, so it's really late. So I'll get a little bit of, uh, I guess, time to get warmed up with calling and roosting birds and... I see a baz over there. Um, you know. At least for me, every year when I'm deer hunting, I find, like, I gotta see that first deer to get used to, like, looking for movement through the trees and all that kind of stuff, and then I'm good to go. So I think... Kentucky will be at least good for that. Hopefully good to get a bird in April instead of waiting till it feels like the middle of May, even though it's really not that late into May. Is that a smallie or is there only spotted bass in here? That's a smallie. 
You'll be fine, probably. Appreciate the confidence. <laughs> what was that thing? Uh, did you see the Torquey I posted in IRL? No. Wait. Maybe. I kind of like vaguely remember seeing a turkey. Opinion on cheese? Um, I I'd make a joke, but that'd be cheesy. The side eye I got for that. Winter's lasted so long this year, they'll probably still be fired up later in the season. I don't know, here, like, I forget exactly what day it is, but we have a, a three-day stretch here next week where it's going to be in the 60s every day. I bought a brisket to do on the smoker when it's like that. Dies from cringe. <laughs> Got a slight smile out of me? That's what I'm here for. Maximum entertainment. What's up, Terrell? I think I'm using a five or six size hook on the regular bait, but in the Norway mission, I gotta catch a gold northern pike with the something lure and has a hook size one. Oh, I wasn't even looking. Pfft. Um, that should work for a gold pike. The next thing would be location. One should catch you silver pikes. Pikes? Are you in the official The Angler Discord? That that would be a place to start. They have a resource hub that could be really useful to you. What's gold for these guys? Like six pounds? <laughs> Must have had some force behind that. That went down like two feet. Around six pounds. I like that they're a bigger species than the smallies. So I guess they're large mouth ish then, size wise. So I feel like the models wouldn't be right, but an ocean style map with ways would be cool. What do you mean by the models wouldn't be right? But yeah, um, a lot of people have wanted, you know, saltwater fishing or. What's it? Offshore fishing, I think, is the term. I think it'd be a neat thing. Like, that's one of those things when it comes to, like, this is going to be a bad comparison, but say lions and stuff in The Hunter Call of the Wild. A lot of people are never, ever going to get to hunt a lion. And in a, I guess, sort of similar way, a lot of people who live, like, say, in the center of the U.S., not saying they're never going to get to offshore fish, but the opportunities aren't nearly as readily available. So it's nice to have something that you can't do in video game land. Whereas, you know, you can go to a different map, but it's, it's a similar style of fishing to what most people have access to within a couple minute drive. Four pounds silver, if I caught that IRL, I'd be freaking out. It was a, it was obviously a, look at you out there on the boat catching golds. Hey, I found out what gold is. Hey, I found out what gold is. <laughs> anyway, it was a large mouth, but I caught a four pounder in West Virginia and I was like losing my mind. I was so thrilled. I got it. He probably won't do it because it would be sort of like, you know, asking somebody to act on camera is just going to be awkward. But I, I would love to get Will to tell the story on camera because the <laughs> his perspective had to be so funny because I had his brother's fishing rod. And it had, I, I honestly can't remember. It was a green, like, Sanko worm, but I, I couldn't tell you what pattern it was. And I was just crawling it along the bottom of this farm pond. And I had a hit, like, three or four times, and I couldn't hook him. So I kept on going back and trying it again. And I finally hooked him, and I realized it was a, nice, it was a decent-sized fish. And Will was probably, I don't know, like, 100 yards from me. And I just went, like, got a decent one or something, like, not to, uh excited I guess and his description of the way I was standing like trying to keep this fish from pulling me in the water <laughs> I need him to do it on camera someday just for my own enjoyment uh, just pulled the boat from storage trying to get out of the water ooh nice I think when we go to Kentucky we're gonna be in a campground I'm gonna bring my little uh, like inflatable pontoon boat thing and we're gonna try to do a little fishing it's just a one man boat but is that four pounder your PB? Yes. What's up, Ender? 
Your PB largemouth is 4.6, but I hope to break that this year. Mine was uh, probably be like 4.1. It was four pounds, two ounces. Where are you fishing? Like farm ponds or what kind of place are you looking to break that? Gold for common carp is 36 pounds. I've got so many 30 pounders and they're always just shy. It's just my life in this game. Uh, bottom boys bring in like a fairly short tag along camper. So we'll be in good shape there. Seven pounder in Illinois? Dang. Illinois, what's wrong with me? I'm so sorry. Since you're going to Kentucky, you might as well come more south. If you got a place to kill turkeys, let me know. A lake below a... What is a by dam? Big dam. That makes more sense. <laughs> I know it. It's funny then your PB is in my state. My PB is in your state. Huh. What are the odds? There was... I've told this story before. We had a membership at a sportsman's club. And they had a pond with... I think it was it was 10 pounds something. And I know that because several people caught that bass out of that pond to weight it. And it was spawning along the edge, or nesting, I guess, along the edge of the bank the one day. And I've told this story. Like, I had just a night crawler. I just kind of threw it out there and let it drift right in front of it. And it hit it, and I went to set the hook, and it just snapped the line. It was 15-pound braid. Like, I don't know. I guess I shouldn't have tried to have such a violent hook set, but I never would have dreamed it would just snap from the pure weight of the thing. Trying to catch a 60 plus diamond grass carp? Where are you, where are you fishing for them at? Found a really good setup for all three Kerper. I do like the Kerper. Is it all, is it the same lake? Am I understanding that correct? Sadly, our club will what? Sadly, our club no allows guests for turkey hunting. Kind of, you know that that's how it goes, though. If it, if everybody's allowed to bring a guest, then suddenly there's way less turkeys. What's up, Dusty? Uh, nothing too special yet. We're doing a little bit of spotted bass fishing, which you can tell is going really well. <laughs> With my name. Yeah, look. See that boat out there? That Kyla's on? That's not her boat. This is this guy's boat. I don't know if he's in the stream or not, but I was standing like there. Girl. What's that? Just because I have my hair down, so I look like a girl. Oh. I was standing there like, hey, maybe this guy will come, like, give me a ride. Because you got to push a boat to get over here, and it takes a long time. So I'm, like, sitting there. Nothing. I would go to get a boat to push, and the guy just drives over to the bank and picks Kyla up and takes her out of where I wanted to go. And she got a gold one. <laughs> Second pond north of Dino Park. Second pond. Wait. Like this one? I love how sad the spotted bass look in the handbook. They do, because their eyes are so big. <laughs> you know the don't worry, be happy bass? The uh, big mouth billy bass? This is like sad mouth spotted bass. <laughs> he stole Kyla from me? He did. Absolute jerk. What's going on, Reinhardt? One above that. Okay. That was the one I was assuming, but... If we don't get a bite in... We'll, we'll let it drift to 200 feet. We'll go and get after something else. It's 9 a.m. It's almost tigerfish time. I think I do. What are you catching them on? Well, that would make sense. I don't know if I can reach far enough to where it's going to be effective. Size one's going to be way too big. Well, lucky me. I guess I unequipped my size six one I used to bring around. <laughs> what if I do a... Is there a carp in here? Because I could do a bottom fishing rig with a red worm. Also, I'm going to let it drift to 200 feet. Gets an idea and immediately cuts the line. Huge brain. I'll give this one try. See what happens. Is 
this the Krusty Krab? No, this is Patrick. Is Flint drinking? Just a little bit. It may or may not be Miller time. Back to back to back gold grass carp. So when you're targeting something that big, I'm assuming you're using a four out, huh? Another blocky normal? I killed three on Red Feather today in the same session. Uh, two were piebald in the same area. Like, I could see them both at the same time. And yet I can't kill Amela. It's always Miller time? I can't disagree with this. Do you know how often they launch new maps for the angler? Okay. I keep forgetting there's no indication and I don't have my hand on the mouse, so I'm like smacking my desk and the mic and stuff when I gotta set the hook. Uh, so let's think. The game has been out for about a year and a half and they've released three maps, so about every six months it looks like. It's actually, ooh, that's a decent looking fish. It's a little over a year and a half. I think their models are just huge. Because the first one I caught, I thought was gonna be a gold. Well, maybe this will be effective. Need a good albino and a pie, got a good melon and normal. My, I mean, what is good? Because I have 148 and 149, I think, for my albino and pie bulb. Going trout fishing Saturday, maybe in my own creek here in front of the house. Um, it, it's too crowded anywhere I go. We've had these conversations before, like in the chat. My general sort of, I guess, opinion on it is I want to go fishing to be like, you know, in the outdoors and enjoying the outdoors, not enjoying the the warmth of my neighbor who's fishing two inches away from me because I just caught a fish. <laughs> 160 plus is what I'm after? I don't have a single 160 block tail. It's terrible. Did they change Red Fox time? Not recently. They changed it with... Um, the Reventuli thing, I believe? Saturday, especially at the lakes, is going to be crowded because the cricks are so high. They might be down enough by then. Uh, Nox, thank you for subscribing. What map is your favorite? It's hard to argue with Africa right now in this game. I do feel like there could be some recency bias there, but... I, just, I like the species a lot. Tigerfish are a lot of fun. Spotted bass, if you can be in the right area, which it seems like this is at least a good spot to go for them. Um, what? Be in the right area. Oh, yeah, if you can be on the boat where Kyla's at. That's not even what I meant. I just meant that I didn't know about this lake. The There's a lot of big fish. Like, the catfish are huge. The largemouth yellowfish get to, like, 40-some pounds. Grass carp, mirror carp, common carp. There's just big stuff. Bill's fan here. Yeah, um, interesting thing. I, I feel like they're just trying to rebuild. Instead of, like, go for it this year, they're trying to build a team that can compete for five years. They may not be as good this year, but it, it might work. Browns fan. Speaking of kind of more so going for it, I feel like that's their approach right now. Since it's a Drinky Boy stream, I went and grabbed a Hard Arizona. Nice. Are those 99 cents? I bet not. Biggest trout you ever caught? I, I don't ever weigh trout when I catch them. So I'm going to have to go with, like, it was a, I think it was 21 inches. It was a rainbow. It was stocked in a sportsman's club pond. So it wasn't, like, the coolest catch ever, but it was a decent fish. I'm 95% sure you'll pull a diamond if you keep fishing that pond right now. Never 100% or else I'll look stupid if you don't catch one. What's like the... See, here's the thing. There's no warning with these. So I feel like if I'm going to tab out and look, it's a bad idea. Water temperature obviously matters. So I wonder what the best time to catch one is. I'm thinking the one Kyla caught in that other lake. And I don't know if the lakes change at different rates. In theory, they should. Like a smaller lake should warm up faster than a big one. Uh, I think it was before tigerfish time, which would sort of be now. 
Yawns in 23-inch rainbow and 21-inch brown? I don't have any decent brown trout. Like, you know, 14, 15 inches from a stocked stock stream. My, my best friend growing up, I want to say he had one Palomino or Golden, if you want to use the correct term, uh, one rainbow, and then his brother got a rainbow. All three of them were 25 plus inches, and they didn't catch any with a fishing rod. They dove in on top of them and caught them with their hands. 75.4 is what you want the diamond at. The water is perfect when you're at. Hey, come pick me up. Been seeing videos on the tube, but never knew there are a decent amount of wild browns in PA. Yeah, I know for sure the Susquehanna. Not only does it have a lot of them, it's got big ones. It's a slightly bigger fish, I think. Still not a gold, I don't think. The fishing game would be more interesting if you could drag out a shotgun and ducks fly in. I would even like if there was just wildlife sort of around, even if you couldn't shoot it. There's ambient sounds of a bunch of different animals and stuff, but you, you can't actually ever see them. Catching any fish? Well, not doing as good as Kyla because that guy out there on the boat brought her to the good spot. So I'll explain this again. I'm giving you credit for catching a gold. Um, so, there's no boat launcher. That's a gold, right? Ha! I'm good, too. Ha! Good job. <laughs> Big mail! Yes! On the board! Okay. I will try this again. As soon as I cast So, the nearest boat launch is here. If you want a boat on this lake, like that guy has out there, you gotta push it from down there. I tried to do that, it went really poorly. So I'm standing on the shore. When I was over here, not that the guys in the stream were like worried, hear me, I didn't type in the chat and ask him. But I was like, I wonder if this guy will come over here and like, let me jump on his boat. And he was just fishing. So I went to get my own, and when I left, he went right over to the bank and picked up Kyla. <laughs> come on, man. Yeah, I guess I'm a pleb in his eyes. Hope the tiger fish is a legendary. Honestly, if it's not, like, I feel like they're just, they're fumbling that one. Hey, bottom boy. I was saying earlier, I was talking about that uh, four pound bass that I caught down there with you. I was saying I got to get you to tell the story on camera because your, like, impression of the way I was standing trying to land that thing is my favorite thing. Got to be a professional boat pusher? I am certainly not. That I learned. You want a steak? I think that'd be a mistake. <laughs> Should have showed him some leg or something. <laughs> hey, buddy. You want to give a lad a lift? Back to silvers. When the legendaries come out? I wish I could remember how long it took for the Spain legendaries to release. Like, it wasn't bad, as I recall. Like, a couple of months at most. Not even that, I don't think. That government boy. What's going on, man? You're not a spy, are you? Ooh, that's a good cast. Misfishing bowfin, not to be confused with snakehead. Wait, what's the difference? Snakeheads here, I believe you're supposed to kill on sight, like if you catch one. Gotta remember exactly what you said, something along the lines of, oh hey, I think I've got one. Yeah, I can't remember what I said exactly. I know it was semi-casual for what ended up being a nice fish. <laughs> and then just, just like contrasting that with trying not to fall in the water as he tries to make me have a watery grave. This time vice sucks, but I'm having fun. We're having fun. Holy. I'm assuming you don't do friend requests from randoms since you're like famous and cool. So here's the thing. I wish um, the angler and the hunter were separate because like I, I do accept friend requests. Like if somebody's in the session, they're like, hey, I want to join your session. I'll accept their friend request. The reason I don't just accept every request I get is be 
I guess there's Carper in here. Um, the reason is I don't want, like, when I'm trying to record in Call of the Wild, I don't want to just make it easy for everybody to just join me and run around and follow me, because unfortunately that happens a lot. What's up, Johnny? Is the angler worth it? I suppose it depends. Like, I think as long as you know what you're getting with the angler, I think it can be worth it. What I mean by that is, if you're familiar with the Hunter Call of the Wild, obviously Call of the Wild, the angler, very similar games. And I would say they, they sort of, they fill the same niche within their subgenre. Meaning, the Hunter Call of the Wild is kind of arcadey in a sense. You're going to find a lot of animals. You're going to kill a lot of big ones. You know, with maybe a little bit less than realistic tactics and stuff. And I would say the same thing about the angler. You're going to catch a lot of fish. A boat guy. Save me, save me. <laughs> I hate that mask, I'm just saying. But I love that mask. Please never take me out of your boat. God, that face. I'm going to cast right in front of Kyla. Oh, oh God. The sound. Okay. It's fine. It went away. Can I? Oh. Okay, I don't know how I move, but that's fine. He sure do got a pretty nose. <laughs> he sure do. <laughs> that nose is built different than it is. I can't wait for Doan to immediately catch a diamond. Riz Tasky, what's up, Dilly? Both in are prehistoric and protected while snakehead are invasive and destructive. Fair enough. Took my brother inshore last week. Pretty slow fishing, but we got a couple of nice black drum, a small trout, and a bluefish. I almost had to ask what a bluefish is, but I'm pretty sure I've seen those before. That's pretty cool, man. When you're in the boat, try a seven popper. What about a five popper? I don't have a seven. I will catch a fish on this cast, and then I'll try that. I think I only own literally that cast sound I almost thought was getting a strike. I'm pretty sure I own literally a 5 and like a 2 odd for poppers. You're invasive and destructive. A 5 will work. Sounds good. Do you have like bream or something in America? I don't know if we have bream. I'd imagine somewhere we do. I saw a fish. Bowfin don't have the scales on their head and snakehead do. Easiest way to tell? Not that I've ever actually seen either, like, in person. But that's a good thing to know. Common bream? No. None at all? It's funny, I was doing better from the shore. Where are you from? Pennsylvania. Chili? The water? Is it is it still in the 74s? Well, in that case, at least I haven't missed my window. Bream are basically just sunfish family, so bluegill, perch, etc. And yeah, we have a lot of those. I thought bream were like almost uh see i don't know enough about fish but i thought bream were more akin to like a koi or a goldfish or something not looks but kind of family you're 60 feet deep you need a top water lure or float i'm using a crankbait and i catch gold spotted bass from this boat <laughs> What's going on, Andy? Bream are carp related. All right, we've come up with a lot of different species. Some somebody here is correct. Silver again, I think. There's a guy in shorts back here catching fish behind me. Poppers kind of crazy for them. 
Is that so? I do have a froge too, if we gotta try a froge. I think that's a six. What's that? Oh. He's tired of your nonsense. I know Bream is a nickname for Bluegill? That's about it to your knowledge? Well, that's more knowledge than I have. <laughs> is is 3x retrieval good for these? Anyone know where I should look for Grey Wolves in Yukon? The Recovering Forest is still good, uh, up in like the northwest. There's a bunch of them in like the Crimson Plain area, specifically in the southwest-ish of that. How many bream is there? It seems every species is a bream, if you disbelieve. 3x is good. Catches zero fish. Alright, what if we try a 6? Just for fun. It's a bit annoying that you can't pop the poppers in the game. I wish they made an actual sound. That... There's a couple of topwater things, like w when I say about fly fishing. Nymphing is something they should add to with fly fishing, but I imagine they would do dry flies first. It seems like that'd be an easier thing to add. But I'd really like to see, like, poppers making an actual sound when you're working them on topwater. And then also, uh, in addition to that, I want the topwater strikes, like what we just had there, I want there to be a splash as it hits the lure. Because no real fish just sort of, well, some real fish will just kind of grab the lure and not surface at all, but that basically doesn't happen with uh, at least fly fishing. How am I 16 feet away? That was odd. Pop my third great one bear in three days? Not too bad. Fabled spotted, what all do you have now? I meant common, real European toilet seat looking bream? What? I don't know what a real is. I don't think I've heard of that one. Kyla's character looks amazing. That's not Kyla's character, but we can pretend it is. <laughs> Are there any newer style bait casters in the Angler? By that, do you mean newer than what they had like on release? Or do you mean, like, is there a say something that came out in the last couple of years that's different than a typical bait caster. Both glaciers and a spot at least they're all different though. No super rare? It's funny like I got there's a Kerper. I got two super rares on my first grind ever for great ones and in a combined like 15 odd thousand kills maybe more than that in the four grinds since. It's more than that then. Yeah I'm way off. Is 5400 for red deer uh, 61 for fallow, so that's 11.5. Like, 8-ish for bear, so we're close to 20. And then 5 or 6 for moose, so let's say in 25,000 kills since then, not a single super rare, not even a super troll. Really nothing that close, if I'm being honest. Had a nice 4, there's a gold, a nice 4, uh, albino moose. Biggest rare bear was, I think, a 7. Fallow deer, I don't even think I had a bighorns rare, or big antlers. And red deer, I had a nice mythical piebald. We knows better? Yes, I am Kyla, I just saw that. I appreciate, the, oh, that's a decent fish. I appreciate the boat, by the way. I can compete with the best of them now. Most similar fish to bream in North America are going to be sunfish, so they're not actually related, but similar. Works for me. I don't think he was like a diamond. He didn't look huge, but didn't look like a terrible fish. Maybe he'll come back. Got a Super Troll cinnamon on my first grind. Super Trolls just shouldn't exist. If you get lucky enough to have... Uh, max level that's also a rare the game should just make it a diamond don't you think the fish in game are a little too big do you mean model wise because if that's what you're going with some are too big some are too small it's weird 
Like I don't I don't feel like they've nailed model scaling just yet. I wish I knew where that one went. Let's try off this side. Just looked it up, according to the Florida Fish and Wildlife, bream is the sunfish species, although some people identify bream differently. So what are the, I see a fish, what are the bream on uh, Spain then? Or Norway, potentially. Tips on catching pike in Spain? I wish I knew more about that map, but I, I really, someone else may have a better answer. I really know nothing about it. That's another spot. It looked almost more like kind of coppery, brassy in the distance. I thought it was going to be a smully. Number one species. Look at Doe just out fishing me. <laughs> Number one species that needs to be added to a map in Call of the Wild. My concern, like I want to say doll sheep. That's the one I want. But my concern with doll sheep would be... You know, sort of every diamond is going to look quite similar. So maybe an antlered animal would be better. What would you choose as for an antlered animal? Like, that's where it gets kind of tough because we don't have a lot of antlered animals that aren't already in the game. For minnow for pike, might get some eel. Most pike hotspots are also eel hotspots and vice versa. How big do the pike get on Spain? Because four seems kind of smallish, but I don't know how big they get. Why is this thing acting weird? That's a bass. I just kind of thought it would try to spit the hook. Got 23 trout last Saturday in Southern PA. Can't wait for next Saturday. Not a, not a bad day. Was it nice out last weekend? I kind of already forget. Just a little bigger than the ones on Golden Ridge. Makes sense. I, w I knew they were smaller on Spain than Norway, but I didn't know at all, like, how big they got. The specific common bream uh, is pretty much all over the rivers in Europe. I wonder if they're in the rivers on Norway. I'd only target, like, trout, basically. You should definitely do that little Bible. That's a great idea. When we were uh, when we were out, I don't know if that was a week or two weeks ago already. I think it was last week. I can't remember. Anyway, climbing up the hill there to walk up to the the road to walk out, I found like a chunk of deer hair. I don't know if one fell or whatever, and I wanted Big to make a fly out of it, and he said, "Absolutely not." So I threw it back down. How would you feel about elephants? I think they would be fine to add. I can imagine why EW would be concerned about like negative perception, but then the other side of it is model size and like what the engine can deal with and stuff from the things they've said before that might be an engine limitation. Cause dad is mean. You're right. I think all the northern trout are probably southern trout now. So much rain. You're probably right. They've all, they've all since migrated, whether on purpose or by accident. You guys go find the diamonds. We'll just be here. I feel like sitting in one spot might actually be better. Um, my brother Pixel, his basement has like two feet of water in it. It's insane. This game will be better? Uh, what you mean? What's up, Mystical? Oh my. We have been fishing for an hour. Time flies in this game. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to finish this one, and then if I get up, Shadow's going to get up. That's the problem. back there he just stuffed his fishing rod down his shirt 
Need someone to fix that basement issue? Kind of my job? Uh, I honestly have no idea if they've gotten that taken care of or not. I'll ask them. Hey, look at that guy catching a diamond catfish. So, like, I can't catch catfish during the day. In theory, they should be catchable, and clearly they are. Because they're so far down in the water, like, the time of day doesn't affect them as much. At least if you're bottom fishing, but I never have any luck during the day. Is the angler hard to play? Nah. It's, if you're familiar with the Hunter Call of the Wild at all, it's like the fishing version of the Hunter Call of the Wild, meaning it's kind of like simplified and, and uh, player friendly. Is that, a, is that a phrase that makes sense? Just drink the water in the basement and it'll go away. <laughs> like, I'm just, I'm just remembering the photo and how like greenish that water is, I'm sure. F so their apartment or house actually that they're renting is I'm pretty sure over 100 years old 100 years of who knows what in that basement just I wouldn't drink it <laughs> our basement like has a not a finished floor necessarily but like it's like a cement floor that's painted I don't know if I don't know if that quite describes it but it's a fairly clean basement as basements go and I wouldn't drink water from our basement either. Sounds like protein. Ew. Alright, I'm gonna throw a red worm out here real quick and finish this drink. It's kind of my problem. When I started using the popper, <laughs> I got no time to... Oh, wrong button. I'm a Ravens fan, even though I'm excited to see Lamar and Henry combo. I'm more excited to see the AFC North as a whole. All the teams are looking pretty good. It should be some good football. I can't think of a single game... Maybe Ravens Bengals last year where Burrow got hurt. Was there a bad AFC North matchup at any of the games last year? Like, th they were all good by my recollection. What do you think of uh, Patrick Queen? Under my desk. Is she under that oh, is she? Yes. <laughs> Shadow is entirely under a blanket right now. Kerber? I s what is that thing? Might be a moggle. I can't tell. It, sh it can't be a bass. Uh, almost 100... Almost impossible to 100% seal a basement. Sumps are life. I See, this is a good way to jinx myself. But ours has to be close to 100% sealed considering the amount of water we had, like, pouring down off the retaining wall behind the house that was then running up against the foundation and nothing got inside that I found. Can the fish be made into a specimen? If you're talking about, like, a taxidermy kind of thing? No. Unfortunately not. That is a model. Bronze. Lame. Little fishy. So we call in the business a small male. Kind of sad, but Queen should be good for the Steelers. Hopefully, our second year will be a good replacement. Oh my goodness! She's dragging the blanket around now. <laughs> what? Uh, who even is going to be the replacement? I'd imagine I'll know the name. If it's a block foundation, it'll leak eventually. Ours is stone, actually. It's stone, and then on the inside, it's all painted white to be brighter in the basement. Oh yeah, challenges exist in this game. I should do that. Shadow's trying to make the carpet softer. <laughs> uh, what are things I'm actually going to do? That'll be fine. We'll eventually do some catfishing, so sure. And then I don't even have the weeklies going. Ah, just in time. That's a okay looking fish. It's always hard to tell though with the 
like the models at a distance, that's high silver, low gold tension. Keep a latex coat of paint on the inside then every three to five years. Didn't even really know that it would need repainted, but I will do that. Trenton Simpson, I do recognize the name. Not even that high of a silver. All right, back to lore as we go. I was killing two diamond fallow every night on my grind, but for the past three days I've got nothing. That'll kind of just happen. Like, how many how many kills do you think you're getting per night? And also, are you doing any kind of herd managing or just like kind of killing everything? Someone else has entered the arena. Where's the leak, ma'am? Oh, it's nut butter. He's gonna come catch a diamond spotted bass and show us how it's done. That's fake. He's level 12. Ignore the 7. 100 to 150 only males? Yeah, especially if you're not doing any kind of management, that will just sort of happen sometimes. And then all of a sudden, you're just gonna have a breakthrough and you're gonna have diamonds again. It's just kind of how it goes. What's up, King Patriot? How many fish have you caught so far on the stream? Uh, I don't know how many total, but we've had one gold spotted bass thus far. It's like a seven and a half pounder. Out of this pond, I've seen Kyla caught one. I think the, whatever his name is, Jim Lee or something. And that boat has one or two. I know Doan has at least two here. So we've had like maybe six or seven golds. Had to push the boat back up. So... I'm clearly just doing something wrong. Oh, you got another gold. Nice. Maybe there's a certain spot on that hill I gotta hit. So you just slow roll and it does the action on its own for you? I'm holding left control to... to get the twitching action. Which is why I haven't been able to finish my beers as fast. So now I'm just gonna leave the lore sitting there for a second. You should do a survey and have all the followers say what they do for a living in eclectic bunch here. Did I even say that word correctly? I feel like we have darn near every profession represented somewhere. We could have an entire society just from this community. Wow, that canary cobra has to be so close to diamond. Gotta go more to the left? Oh, for, for, I was thinking you meant casting at first. Yeah, that kind of makes sense, because it was, it was stupid steep where I was trying to go. Root beer? Hey, nothing wrong with the root beer. I haven't had one in a while. I think since Aaron was here. We went to Wendy's and I had a, what, you, what uh, I don't know what I got, but I know I had a root beer with it. Heavy equipment operator work for a drilling and blasting company. I bet that can be both fun and, what's the word I want? Uh... Frustrating sometimes. Well, my dad was heavy equipment operator, and some of the characters, I knew that was a big fish. Some of the characters that he's described. I'll be the bream in the society. Perfect. We had a little bit of Snow King Patriot. Nothing that stuck for more than a minute or two. When I was driving home, there was a point where the road was entirely white, but it was mostly like, sort of, I guess, sleet. Sleet's not really the right word for it. Cut a 1.76 pound gold? Isn't diamond 1.8 or am I just misremembering? Look at that rod work. <laughs> just doing what's going on. Had slight hail this afternoon for like 10 minutes. We had it for a little bit longer than that, but that, that's all we had. Everybody's catching golds. I'm not getting a single bite. What's going on here? Don't appreciate this game. I took two seconds to take a drink. I'm so sorry. Give me my golds. Actually, screw that. I'm going to be cool. I'm going to catch the only diamond. Get the diamond. I kind of forgot how to catch fish in general, so. Andrew has a 1.77 diamond. You have a 1.76 gold. That's not fair. 
I thought 1.8-ish was right, though. That one didn't look terrible, either. Okay, not as big. Whatever fish that was, I guess, is just too small to hit this frog. Welcome back, Maximus. Being a dedicated subcontractor that... Oh, hi. It's a nice smolly. Or not. Sure looked big to me. Anyway, I shall try to read that again. Being, being a dedicated subcontractor that does a specialty they can't live without generally makes it easier. That kind of makes sense. All your diamonds are trolls? For the... You mean level 5s? You mean like the fallow? I'm telling you, the spotted bass models make it tough. They're all big. Anything good since I left? Uh, were you here when we got the gold spotted bass? Around us, there have been like a good 7 or 8 golds caught by now. So, we're kind of lacking behind. But we also have one gold, so we're also cool. Uh, how do I do the management correctly for Fallow? I think you basically just don't shoot level 2s. I'm pretty sure that's all it is. Can't even catch any fish now? I'm kind of having that same problem too. I had that random smallmouth. And then I forgot to check the water temperature to see if we're in the right zone here. Which legendaries are we going after? Um, honestly, maybe all of them. We'll see. It's already 8 o'clock and we're still trying to catch spotted bass now that everybody's here i feel like especially because of the effort that was gone through to push boats over here we we can't just leave immediately so we'll see uh i think gold seem to be the first one we try to get though is this even a bass eh, it might be a smallie again or a baby spotted i thought i saw the eyes Yes, yeah, Molly. Your older brother hooked Goldstein ten minutes after you. Oh, nice. Nightbot said no caps. That's like the third time. I missed the first two entirely. Most recent diamond of the angler? Uh, a couple days after release, maybe like a day or two after release, I caught another diamond tiger fish. It was 30, 30 and change, but... Still not as big as the one I caught in early access. Six crankbaits working? Leave it to me to not have one. What kind of vehicle do you drive when you go hunting or do you just walk? Uh... If I understand what you're asking correctly, you don't mean like when I'm driving to Kentucky, like what truck or whatever do I have? You're talking about like, say from the house to the stand or whatever? I, I'm pretty resistant to to using a foiler or anything. For years, it's funny actually, like almost every buck opportunity we ever have in rifle season, we had taken a four-wheeler down. For years, my dad would always take my brother and I to our spots on a four-wheeler. Uh, I don't know, when I was 16 or so, I started just walking to the spot on my own because I didn't want to spook things. Did that help? In rifle season, probably not. In archery, clearly that can make quite a difference. It's a tiny fish. Four-wheeler's a big no-no. Oh, nice fish. Nice. We had to be really careful with that one. Gold, I think. Sweet. How many diamonds do you have in the angler? Hey, I did a thing. I don't know what thing I did. Um, yeah, like, removing golden trout, which were bugged when they came out, I think four. Like, I, I didn't really understand how diamonds worked for a good chunk of how I, or like when I played the game. The, the fact that I have the diamond rainbow, 
I'm pretty sure I was streaming with Mel at the time. Like, I think that's how I caught it. Or maybe he was in a video. I don't know. But I know I caught him off a boat. On like a popper or something in a river. And it was pretty cool. But much like the diamond tiger fish, I sort of just happened to be right place, right time, right water temperature. Wasn't trying to catch a diamond. Which does make it kind of fun when they happen. In West Virginia, we climb these mountains on a range from 1,000. Dude, the, uh, as much as, you know, you can, that's a pretty decent looking one. You can spend all that time walking to your spots and, like, trying to make sure that there's never any vehicle disturbances and the, the deer are never going to, you know, potentially know you're even in the area. When it comes to retrieving a deer, when you can drag it, whatever, 60 yards up a hill and throw it in the back of a ranger, boy, does that make your day go so... Like, you save potentially hours of your day where you can do anything. I mean, whether it's, like, go hunting again in the evening or, you know, if you have other stuff to do that day, instead of dealing with the deer the entire morning. Like, we had to go to the gas station and get gas, and we had to stop at your dad's to get coolers, I think? We had at least like an hour and a half trip and we were still done with that deer by like, I think noon. It helped that I killed him at basically first light, but still. Where is this at? This little pond here. That just coming over to join us. Are you a Krusty Krab? No, this is Patrick. Not a Krusty Krab. From what I've seen, you either have to never drive around the property or always drive around it. That's the thing, like, if they kind of are semi-used to it, then it's not such a big deal. Banana Bender, am I reading that correctly? Thank you for becoming a member. Welcome, welcome. Are they re... Yes, they are. Never mind, then. Quite a chance Banana's not even here right now. I drag my deer uphill both ways through feet, feet three to snow. <laughs> In my bare feet or three feet of snow. Are we talking deer hunting, King Patriot, or turkey hunting? Hot dogs. Need a teleporter for the stands? Imagine how much better you can do. This doesn't have the tension, but it again looks like a big fish. I think Dylan must have one too. Yeah. Everybody caught one at the same time. That's kind of weird. Who won? Uh, well, I don't remember what mine weighed. <laughs> okay, I think I won. Are you really good at fishing? Um, fish pun, come on. Uh... Pike, I'm okay. Hey Shannon, thank you for subscribing. That one's a real alert. Your videos help me get through my grind every night, so thank you. My pleasure, man. I uh, When I was grinding for great ones, I had to have something played on the side or I would go insane, so glad to be able to help. End up fused to a tree? What's going on, Clark? What's your... Uh, Immediate reaction to Rasheed Rice. Big fish? Question mark? Nah. Took you a while to... To fin fish? Oh, finish. Never mind. I, re I see what you're doing there. What's the week's legendary? It's Goldstein on Golden Ridge. It is Henrik on Norway. And whatever the name of the brown trout is on Spain. Depends where you're at, but at least by me, I don't think a mature buck will ever be used to an ATV. I think in farmland especially, you can pretty easily get them used to ATVs, because like, tractors and heavy equipment and stuff, they, they just hear that. If they're remotely in the area, they hear it really often. If you're away from that kind of thing, then yeah, you're more likely to kind of run them out of the area, I would say. Not even that easy. My tailgate dropped coming out of the hauler last year. My buck went sliding out the back 
Loading on a hill alone ain't easy. I remember you saying you could you could hardly because that was a big body deer. You could hardly get them into the the back of the buggy on your own. That uh, screenshot I took of the video of loading the buck into the back of uh, your ranger is still my Twitter banner, by the way. What legendary can I, can I catch at level 16? Goldstein for sure. Probably Henrik. All three of them, I think. Because Henrik's 20-something pounds, I believe. Goldstein's 22 or 26. I think 22. And the brown trout's not even that. I don't know what he weighs, but he's not that big. How long will you be streaming? I don't know. We'll kind of just see what happens. I still want to go after legendaries at some point, but... This is kind of a good time to go for Spotted Bass, so we're just all trying to catch them right now. I only shoot yearlings so I can carry them out of my shoulder. I, I'm thinking the sh specific show I'm remembering is Jeremiah Johnson. Whatever show it was, a guy carries out a four-corn buck on his shoulder, and I just know I'll never be capable of that. And it kind of makes me sad. Big Steen is 13 kilo. Alejandro is 20 kilo. Is Alejandro the brown trout? He's 44 pounds. Well, never mind then. I was way off on that. Maybe we should try to catch him. I didn't realize he was that big. Uh, It's not in the current plans, Lucas, but I guess never say never. Charged deer so small is able to throw it like a sack across the creek. My brother-in-law has a picture of one he shot. Where? Oh wow, Kyla caught a diamond. That's bigger than your other one, right? No. no? How big's your other one? My other one is, um, eight, five. This is oh. It might as well be bigger then. <laughs> Nah, a popper's better. Wow, it went up that much? Is it technically water temperature or air temperature? In theory, it should be water. Anyway. That's why you bring Aaron hunting, he's the pack mule? You're not wrong. Oh, yeah. There's a, there's a picture of my brother-in-law holding the deer he shot. He's almost holding it like a rabbit. Like, he's got it by the back legs and it's not even close to touching the ground. Big man. Kyla's RNG in this game is just different. That's a nice Kerper. I'll take it. Will I keep my trophies if I hit new game? Your trophy lodge will stay, but like all your stats will reset. Tied legs that pieball together and carry it like a suitcase so I wouldn't pull the white hair while dragging it. Honestly, like, kind of smart though. I don't know if my first thought would be Oh, hey, I gotta make sure I don't pull the hair out. Because I've had a couple where, especially a mature doe, if I gotta drag it up a hill, it's just, you know, in, I don't know, six or eight foot chunks where I grab it and sort of pull it as far as I can, then stop and take another big step, sort of like that. I've taken out huge chunks of hair when I get, like, up against a log or whatever. Have you ever a donkey before? I never have a donkey. I live in PA and I think the hunting is good, but you have to have land. I'm 18 and don't have the money. Yet, I mean, having private land certainly helps a lot in any state. There's some decent public in PA, but it's more so decent in archery. Rifles so crazy, unless you have, you know, some secret honey hole that nobody knows about. It's tough to not just run into a bunch of people. They don't call it the Orange Army for nothing. I almost said Orange Donkey because I was reading Nut Butter's message. <laughs> I don't call it the Orange Donkey for nothing. 
Try dragging a 600 pound bear? I've often wondered, like, you know, if you're, like, Remy Warren does, like, solo hunts. I'm sure he has people helping with this. But, like, when he kills a moose or something, what do you do? You can't drag a moose. I don't know if there is any Dilly Cane that's not still full of hunters. I have seen that, Maximus. I, I've never done it. The guys at the hunting camp that my uncle owns that we've been to a couple times for squirrel season and stuff used to do it. People get so ignorant on public land. You definitely can run into some characters. I think that's the same guy that cut a nice gold canary curper earlier, so I'm glad he got a diamond. Getting wacky and throwing a gold only hook? See, I sometimes do that. And then I don't catch anything for like four casts, and I'm like, this is dumb. And I go back to silvers, and that's why I don't catch big males. What game this is called the Wild the Angler? He's one. He field dresses them and then takes the quarters, then the back straps and the loins. I mean, it could be a little wasteful, but I guess depending on how far you're going. Uh, Nick, think of the nine months, by the way. I don't think that alert's going to want to come up. Appreciate that. Finally here for a stream. It's been so long. Not only a stream, but a stream where we might be visiting streams. Imagine that. Appreciate you, man. Doing good. How about you? There you go, Lucas. That's a way to do it. What time is it? It's 1500. We're just yeeting through this entire day. It has also been nearly an hour and a half. Day goes by quicker than I thought that in this game. An hour and a half would be... Yeah, the time scale is quicker in this game than Call of the Wild. I thought the daytime was four, like, four game hours for one real hour like Call of the Wild. The night was like double that. Evidently not. No worries, Sean. I am indeed on the screen. That guy over there in the green poncho looking thingy. Does anybody have that outdoor cosmetics pack? Because I want to know what's in it. I kind of want to buy it, but I already wear camo, so it seems like it's pointless. Have you ever eaten deer heart? Yes. Typically now... What? Yeah. Typically now we just grind it in with hamburger, but I have had it just like pan fried like you're talking about. It's a muscle. It's the same as any other deer meat. What makes it special? Kyla's appalled that she's eating deer heart now. What do I tell her that she's eating deer tongue too? You haven't eaten deer tongue. <laughs> Can't do deer heart. The concept grosses me out. Well, if you ever decide to try it, make sure you cut the big arteries out. That is a part of it. Fresh bear liver. But uh, okay, in my head, I thought for some reason you were eating it like. Uh, why do I always forget the word? Like tartar or whatever. But you didn't... You said fresh, not raw. Random money question. Yes or no? Always yes. Fresh bear liver raw? I don't know why, but that's the way my brain perceived that. Head to bed meme of a monkey? Sounds good, man. Appreciate you hanging out. You can eat bear, bear liver raw, but a light breading and hit the frying pan for a few seconds is awesome. Would that... Oh, I thought that was a gold. Close. Would that not put you at severe risk of, um... Trichinosis? Uh, my brain is so dumb. Tuberculosis is all that I can 
think of. Polar bear liver. There might be less chance of tuberculosis in Arctic conditions. Haven't tried deer liver? We tried it once. We did like a liver and onions thing. It was like, should we probably save the liver from most deer as long as it's not shot through or some deer, you know, they'll have different conditions where you might not want to keep it. The answer is probably yes. It just wasn't good enough to, for me, like me and like my whole family didn't like it. So none of us were like, yeah, we should keep that. You mean trichinosis? Isn't that what I said? Deep fried bluegill eggs. Sort of like fried caviar, right? There goes five bucks. Where goes five bucks? Hopefully not disappeared forever. Liver and onions, the ultimate old man flantro meal, indeed. Bluegill legs. <laughs> you didn't know they had legs? You gotta search really di di digilently, yeah. Diligently. Is the word. Bear meat is greatness, just depends on the way it's cooked. I've heard it is really good, yeah. Like, as long as you don't get, like, a coastal bear. Or a bear, like, right as they're eating for hibernation. Har harbor, yeah. Harbor freight. Is what I meant. Bear depends on what they're eating? Yeah. Do you play the Angler Classic? Unfortunately, no. I wish that existed. Berry bears? Yeah, like that's... From what I can tell, that's the best. Well, I did not spend five bucks, just robbed the game of five bucks and gave it back? Nice. I love Fortnite. <laughs> Cornfield bears? I can see that being good too. I see a fish. Got him! Holy! <laughs> Kyla didn't seem to amused by that. Seemed? Yes. That's like right on the line between gold and silver, I think. Really is, too, at 5.8. Look at those gold tokens. Got 16 of them now. Kyla only has 12, as far as I understand. Don't look at the 50-something gold tokens she has. Wonder how, like, a Georgia or South Carolina bear that eats peanuts tastes? I don't know. Do you guys ever have boiled peanuts? This is, this is, this is the conversation we're about to get into. How many do you have? I thought you had way more than that. I'm not that far from well, behind you then. No, nope, that doesn't count. Yeah. <laughs> Did you guys hear how serious that yell was? They're amazing. Refunded it, robbed my money back. Beautiful. Gold only hook is not hooking. Unfortunate. Boiled peanuts might be hard as a rock? What are you what sort of boiled peanuts are you eating? Because the ones I've had. It's like, um, I don't even know if I can give a comparison for the texture. Like, they just, like what? I love peanuts. Oh, I thought you were giving me a comparison. Boiled what boiled peanuts are you eating? The only ones I ever tried were race track? Race? What gas station did we get them from? Hey, Sean, thank you for subscribing. They were, like, they tasted fine, but I couldn't get past the texture. They, it was like they just disintegrated. I was frowned upon in Kyla's Georgia household for not liking them. <laughs> Camp Town races? That's what I said, yeah. Is a wild boar hunt worth the money in PA? I would certainly imagine no. Unless there's somebody that has them, like, raised in a pen. Because I do know a guy that killed a couple of bison here in PA.
They weren't very good ones, they should melt in your mouth? Wait. That's what I said they did. They more like disintegrated, but... Yeah, same, same idea, I think. Mushy peanuts sounds illegal? Oh god. Oh, hey, Joe, what's going on, man? Look at all these golds. What time is it? Huh? It's 8.19. At 8.30? No. Oh, okay, at some point, whenever Kyle is ready, we'll go and try to catch Goldstein. <laughs> we must have the northern boiled peanuts. I'm sure my dad didn't invent this, but one of the things that... Almost like the only way I've ever had, I don't know what the name of them is, but the peanuts that are in like a shell. Not pistachios. Either. Um, we'll just throw those in like a little foil pan and just warm them on a fire. I swear it makes them so much better. Thinking French peanuts? Close enough. What? You got a canary curper on a crankbait? That's kind of weird. I knew they were aggressive, but... That old dude, one pound or down there, 30 feet, swimming with the whales. Shrewbo, am I saying your name correctly? What's going on, man? I'm back. What did I miss? We caught seven diamonds on cheese. You wouldn't believe it. Boat. Uh, well, the new boat already blew a fuse and had to be taken back to the shop because the fuel gauge didn't work. I guess better now than in peak season? Question mark. I know, he's killing it now. Fresh peanuts taste like carrots. What? Why? Fun nut slash legume fact. I think I said that wrong. Peanuts aren't nuts. They're legumes. See, I feel like I've heard this. I'm, I'm sure I'm saying that wrong. But... Like, how do they get named that, then? You know what I mean? <laughs> like, who who whiffed and has, like, the all-time most confusing thing ever? Chestnuts were always your go-to rifle season snack? What is that thing? That's a grass car, maybe? So, like, how were you doing this? Did you have already, like, it's not really cracked, like, peeled ones? Or... Were you sitting in the stand with, like, a knife? Probably the same people who named a strawberry, which is not a berry. You're a strawberry. What is it tech? Is it just a fruit? Skipping the family reunion to go see Journey and Def Leppard in July? That's a great idea. Just saying, IRL fishing video, watch I will. Peel them on site. Makes sense. Um, I attempted to film our last fishing outing. It didn't exactly go super well, but I have a little bit of fishing footage to potentially put in a future video with future further fishing footage. That was a great alliteration. <laughs> go to gun season snack is whatever doesn't make me go. Yeah, well, that is an important thing to consider. Gushers. Yeah, Kyla's favorite's gushers. Mine is, um, those deli style pretzels like you know the really flat ones you have to you have to take them out of the, like the packaging you get them in though and put them in a sandwich bag so it's a little bit quieter a banana's a berry is it I'd like one more decent spot at bass before we go catch Goldstein Want to take the elephant gun out this year for deer season? What's the elephant gun? I don't think I was informed of this. This month is Ape Awareness Month. Be aware, they be apes. I thought this was a uh, NFT joke. We've caught every spotted bass out of this pond. They don't exist now. Nope. They're not real. Ignore that one Kyla just caught. That one's not real. That's a decoy. 
Am I the only one who has Vienna sausages and pepperoni rolls? I can only imagine the sounds your stomach makes. <laughs> You're probably calling in deer inadvertently. Brrr. Here he comes. 375 H&H &H shooting 320 grain dangerous game loads. Did you see the size of me? <laughs> that would break my shoulder. Dog broke a window so I missed a fish? Like, I feel like I'd be more angry about about the window, frankly. Plus out a window. I guess priorities, right? Next time you go to Georgia, just pick some random roadside peanuts. See, we almost did that the very first time I was down there. There was like a roadside thing that we were going to stop at. And frankly, I, I couldn't tell you why we didn't. But I don't think that's there anymore. I don't, I don't want to say where, because obviously that's a bad idea, but... Laser Ruffles? I like, generally, like, um... Is Ruffles the right word? I know that's the brand. Like, the chip, the wavy is what I like. So if it's wavy Lays, I like, I can't tell you why. But I like those better, and Ruffles are generally wavy, so... I choose Ruffles for that reason. Without the T, got he. Don't be a weenie if you want to try it. Honestly, the 338 Winchester is way worse. Really? Wouldn't have thought that. My goal is to kill a deer with a 10 gauge slug. I bet you if you hit a deer with it, it'll it'll do the job. No fish, it might be time for Golden Ridge then. This is the good time for them? Are spotted bass the same as... I know they're bass. 338 Lapu would probably be worse. I don't know about 338 Wind Mag. I would... Like... If you... Had the two side by side... And told me shoot one... I would pick the wind mag thinking the lapu would hurt my shoulder worst. I'm gonna, I, it sounds like I'm saying lapu, but I swear I'm not. I'm gonna try one bottom fishing cast here. Three thirty eight wind mag is worse than three seventy five H and H. Huh. I read that as fifty BMG at you. <laughs> Wasn't looking. What about the spotted bass? What about the spotted bass? Lapu. Wasn't that uh, Peppy Lapu? Wasn't that? <laughs> wasn't that a thing? Fifty BMG gummies. <laughs> Why is this such a slow retrieval? There we go. Keith Warren hunts with a, a 50 big? And didn't he headshot a doe with it? Know a guy who cut a deer with a 50 BMG? Describe cut. was decent enough that now I gotta try it again. You go on Golden Ridge now? Yeah. Okay. I'll join off you in a second. Missed it and still killed it. I was thinking he might have missed it. But I wasn't sure if that was the story I was remembering. Deer was in half 600 yards across the hall. Who could, Lord? Don't be encouraging the West Virginians. No, you should always encourage West Virginians. Good or potentially funny things happen when you encourage them. Made some fish tacos not too long ago that were made from a Vietnamese fish that was, according to Google, a catfish slash shark. It's really good, but cannot remember the name of it for the life of me. 
Um, my pet goldfish named Steve. We're very normal. They're people too, kind of. Wow. <laughs> this seems to be not a bass. They're normal as West Virginians go, is what I'm getting here. Speaking of shark, fried shark is probably my favorite thing to eat that swims. Deer can swim. It is a bass. Alright, officially last cast on Africa. We're gonna switch to Golden Ridge and try to catch Golden Steen. Swai? Don't know if I said it right, but I saw, like, frozen bags of that at Walmart literally today. Humans can swim, also true. Went through the ears? Surely that would have just caused a very obvious wound, right? I did, though, one time accidentally dispatch a doe that I had spine shot. I shot it directly in the ear with a 30-30. There's just such a difference between a 30-30 and a 50 BMG. Is the only version of the Angler on PS5 the Deluxe Edition? I, I can't imagine why it would be. That'd be a weird way to sell a game. Hopefully not. Is that what you're talking about, the 45 bucks? That would kind of make sense. Are sharks fish? Are fish sharks? Do they have large mouth? Because the the only ones on this map are small mouth and spotted. Oh God, psycho! <laughs> What's going on? What did you miss? I think three gold spotted bass. Kyla caught a diamond. Um, did someone else on this lake catch a diamond? That is that canary Kerber that I think we were talking about. Uh, and we're about to go and try to catch Goldstein literally after with this cast. Good lord, Sasquatch. <laughs> think her that all sharks are fish, but not all fish are sharks. That sounds like the definition of squares and rectangles, and I don't know if I believe it. I think they make stuff up. Maybe he's my brother. <laughs> running from the Mothman. I saw, I don't know if this was actually a thing that's happening or if it was just a singular meme, but I saw a thing of that Mothman statue in West Virginia and there was like a quarter that somebody had like lodged between his butt cheeks and like the post was people have to stop putting coins in the Mothman's butt. Have you been to Africa? I'm here right now. I think I just saw Johnny joined. Sure did. Cheeks? That's what I said, huh? Oh, okay. Are we going to race to see who catches them first? Mm -hmm. Alright. For whatever reason, it has been decided that nothing is going to bite on this cast. Kinky and cheap. Sasquatch. Through the eyes? Yikes. How does it work with Apex Connect? Can you have the same name as other people? I assume not. I don't even know. I think it shows the Steam name. Got skinwalkers to worry about? Sounds like a good time. Level matches, though? Haters. <laughs> what do I do if my whitetail won't cooperate? Uh, what you mean by that? Suck it up. Wow. 
Apex connect uh, Apex accounts are based on email. Yes. So maybe you're right. Toss them a buck. Well. Do you know what all comes with the deluxe version? I imagine we could look it up and find that, but I, I don't know. I'm going to reel this in like 40 feet. I don't know what's going on. I... For bottom fishing and flow fishing, we've had a cast, a cast, a bite every cast, and then I literally say last one, we can't catch a fish. Tell them you're live and see their reaction. I think they know that. Jim might not. Nut butter and um, Doan back here, who I don't think I can move far enough to see, they definitely know. Johnny may or may not know. Why? Thank you. Yeah. Kill a Kai should make a channel? That's a good idea. She should. <laughs> it's dead. What happened? Uh, somebody said I should say that we're live. And then I said you guys know that. We'll see what Johnny catches. Decent. I'm taking too long. I don't know why, but nothing will hit this this cast. No way! You're alive? Yeah, man, can you believe it? Rip. Need to have your boats closer together for the Big 12 performance? It's like the first day of trout season training. Well... I guess it just ain't gonna happen. What are... What are those gloves? Oh, they're just fingerless gloves. I couldn't tell what was going on. Alright, another 80 cents robbed. Excellent. <laughs> We're gonna jump to Golden Ridge, I suppose. Thank you again, Dylan, for the boat. I might have caught zero or potentially one gold. I can't remember if I caught one from the shore or not. Uh, without you? Where are you at? No, I'm saying I might have... Oh, uh, your server's full. That's good. That's what it says. It might be because I'm in a different map, though. Nope, it worked that time. Getting fleeced by Fortnite, clearly. Alright, so... What do I have? I gotta go and get that popper from the... Place. Hope they add Fennec Fox to Rancho, so you have to grind out foxes again. It can't be worse than the Red Fox. I can't imagine it would be worse. Storage. Look at that. 12 gold, zero diamonds on this map. <laughs> Terrible. I don't know why I have two two jerk jerkbaits. That seems like a complete waste of time. Get the one out popper. Logan, thank you for the seven months, by the way. Welcome back. Should do a Minecraft video. Would I be good at that, though? Is there a fast travel there, or do I gotta... Okay. Ninety percent of my whitetail zones have ones, and they're my main. So, like, I, I will be honest, I'm not super, uh... Like, knowledgeable when it comes to herd management and stuff. But I think when it comes to your mains, you're supposed to just shoot them. Hope it's worse. I mean, I need something to do, to be fair. Like, I need something to kind of grind for. Not even grind for, per se. Just, like, spend time trying to get. So I wouldn't be mad if it took me a while. 
it's kind of like the the rare gator rare croc thing i could do that every day and i'd probably have one within a week but i need something to do so it's it's sort of nice that i haven't been lucky and gotten one yet is it at that blue bridge again this is the first place i got him oh no you're over there Where did you look? Let me see. What up if I could spell? Uh, guys, I can't find Goldstein. Finally snagged Goldstein. Why didn't you say where? So we're in the wrong spot. Yeah, you're in the right area. Nope. You didn't let me on your boat. Does time matter for the legendaries now? The way that guy that I'm reading in the uh, trophy gallery typed it almost seems like it might. Four gold piebald gators. That's wild. A room temp IQ. There needs to be a horn on the boat so I can announce my arrival. Huh? You put your foot on the boat when I got there. <laughs> Do you have him on or a different fish? I thought you said to come pick you up. What is this nonsense? Ugh. You look so enthused. <laughs> Gosh, the forward makes you go so much faster. And in reverse, it takes 12 years for it to respond. Having so much whiskey sour right now? Holy! It's gonna go from psycho big to drunk big. She has some big feet. <laughs> You're in my server. Nice. The uh, the Golden Ridge one we just joined. Can I show you where we're at on the map? As long as I don't end up hooking them on this cast. As soon as we bring this one in, I'll do that. No luck first cast. Might be able to eventually see him. This is sort of a big area, though. Like, I feel like it wouldn't be terribly hard to just not realize he's here. So right now we're sitting... Right about there. It's like the biggest little inlet thing here. If she sold feet picks, she could charge double. Oh my... Seven thousand kill grinds aren't hard enough. Just add more fox species. As, well, as bad as the grind for like a singular diamond red fox went, in theory, a singular diamond grind could never be as bad as or as long as some of the great one grinds were. Hey, Thunster, how's it going, man? We're out here trying to catch Goldstein at the moment. We've casted like three times. What do you mean? I've casted like six. Wow. I've had issues catching Goldstein on stream before, funny enough. Other than... I think that was a regular pass. Other than Sidewinder, any legendary we've tried to catch on stream before other than Goldstein, we haven't had problems with. We went after Goldstein one time on stream. 
I don't know, we spent an hour and didn't catch him. What's up, David? What was your first legendary? I don't know. I'm sure it was Golden Ridge. It had to have been Goldstein, because Big Larry, I didn't catch him the first, or her, actually. I didn't catch her the first time that I went after her, and I still don't have Sidewinder. It had to have been Goldstein, but I don't really remember that as being my first one. I guess it could have been like the Norway Pike, but I don't think it was. Oh yeah, there's Newfie. We're almost the same level. Fourteen days till the torture poets department. <laughs> Hope you guys heard that. Well, bait. Uh, right now, I have a one-up popper. Well, aren't you cool? You could probably have a chance at a diamond. I don't know if they're here, but it's not a bad idea to have something you might catch a diamond on, too. Nice, looter. Did you hear about the great one, Rocky Elk? Uh, no. What you mean? No memory flantro? That's me. Yes, he says. Yes, what? It's coming soon. Is this an April Fool's joke like three days later? I feel like we would have heard about that. Did you ever get waiters? Dude, I was at my parents on Sunday and I, like, 12 different times when I was there, I thought, ooh, I gotta go check in the basement and see if my waiters are there. I forgot. What setup are you using and what line strength? Uh, at the moment, I've got the Virtuoso Rod. I've got one of the reels from Africa. 38-pound uh, fluorocarbon and the 2 out popper I mentioned. Some really good Pokemon Go events coming up. What events... Like, I know this is going to sound like a dumb question, but what events happen in Pokemon Go? Is it, like, rare Pokemon spawns or... Crow made a video about the Elk Great one as an option. So not not like reveal, just like it could happen, I guess. Yeah, I was just thinking I might look at a couple of different posts here and see if there's maybe a middle area where people are getting them. The shiny Whalmer? Do they have shiny events? That's kind of cool. Alright, let's see. This guy... Oh, well, that brown trout is pretty big. Okay, this guy caught him pretty far from where we're at. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's looking like... It's closer to... Like, over there. Like... 300 feet from here. What'd you just call me? Uber. Sit down! Why am I in this view? How do I get... There we go. Well, this doesn't mean this is where he's going to be. <laughs> but there appears to be a pattern where people are catching him more like here. I was going to tell you a joke about construction, but I'm still working on it. Well. Do you ever see the movie Constipation? It never came out. I tried to tell that, you know how like everybody goes to school with that one kid that knows everything? I tried to tell that joke to that kid in our school, and I said, do you ever see the movie Constipation? He goes, yeah, I've seen it. I was like, well, it's, it's a joke. It never came out. Oh, well, I've seen it. It's a real movie. Okay. Had to get Mexican food. Did you bring any back for me? Look at that guy catching a gold walleye in the middle of the day. Is it middle of the day? Eh, 1630. Kind of early for walleye, though. It 
something like that, Pixel. <laughs> I guess... I heard a splash, but your head's in the way. <laughs> wow! Hot dogs. That kid's last two brain cells are still fighting for third place. <laughs> What are you using? A uh, two-aught popper, but no luck for me so far either. He should surface. Goldstein definitely surfaces. Surfaces. Is. Legendaries are kind of fast. I might go 4x on this. Did I just crack a cold one? It is a drinky stream after all. What's that? Yeah, he's never been difficult to catch unless I stream it. For whatever reason. Caught two diamond shovel nose sturgeon back to back. That's pretty cool. I want a diamond shovel nose. I like them. Uh, did you miss anything? Like a couple of gold spotted bass? Kyla caught a diamond one because, you know, gotta be outfished, I guess. The ones that have been posted have been in like enough different spots that I could see it being like a fairly wide spawning range. We're pretty much dead on, at least where the one I'm uh, currently looking at was. Fell off a metal roof yesterday, looked at my boss and asked if I could have the first week of trial off. He said no, so I went back to work. <laughs> hey man, I'm going to specifically need next week off after this injury. Not the next couple days though. Surprised you didn't honor that. No drinking allowed on YouTube? Holy! What FOV are you using? Looks kind of nauseating. I don't know, default? Huh? It might not help that the overlay sort of almost makes it widescreeny. Do you know if working that popper slower will be better? I don't think so. It's only eight feet deep here. I don't think a crankbait makes any difference. I cringe watching the animation reel to flip the bail down. I actually haven't seen, I didn't even realize there was, that guy caught a .08 pound perch. I just thought it happened. Is there an animation? I'll have to watch it. Do you mean just grabbing the, like starting the reel basically? Big bass like big meals, maybe try something bigger and slower? I don't have anything bigger than this popper on me right now. This is fun, Kyla says, I just realized that. Maybe we should scout for him and try to see him. The right way would be to flip the bail back down with your hand. I don't think I've ever done that. Well, I have done that specifically with my one rod where it doesn't flip on its own. So may maybe I have ruined it by not doing it, to be fair. A tornado went over my house a few days ago. I heard there's some pretty, pretty crazy weather going all around the east right now. Noofy's on a mission to find him. I 
I don't think he exists. I always flip the bail by hand, but I also kind of guide the line to control the speed. Fair enough. So, like... This isn't a good setup to catch him with. If he hits this, it will be less than fun. But... Uh, while I look at some more posts about where he's been caught, I'm just gonna yeet this out this way. This person says, where's Goldstein? He does look weird in some of these posts I'm seeing. Goldstein's getting old. Just got caught on where we're at. That guy caught him right off the shore. A lot of people haven't posted location. It's looking like going around the shore is the way, though. Some are catching him a little further out. Yeah, let's try off the shore. Even though you already tried that. Goldstein only spawns for Kyla, not for Flinter. I won't be at all surprised if that happens. Oh! Why was it... I don't even know what happened. That's annoying, Dusty. Alright. So, the hope... Okay. The hope is going to be... That we see him. I'm going to give it, like, just a little bit here, just in case. Yeah, you try that side. <laughs> I ain't seeing no thick bass. You don't want a three-out popper? Basically, as long as other fish aren't hitting it, it shouldn't matter what size. Why doesn't Kyla have a mic? She didn't want to be on a mic tonight. It also does, like, so the annoying, one annoying thing about Blue Yetis, if you try to use them with a mixer, you have to actually use their output instead of the input, which is annoying. So basically, the way that you set it up just causes the audio to be a little bit quieter, so at least we didn't have to worry about that, trying to work around it. No steens. Lake Nimmer went up seven inches. I believe it, man. It's been crazy. Huh? Question mark? If anybody sees them surface or something, let me know. You're gonna do what? It's a good strategy. What is this thing? A little sunfish, maybe? Over there! Holy! Here he is! Everybody's fishing in this vicinity and nobody's catching them, which is kind of alarming. That 
There's Cheech. What's up, hippie man? Doing pretty good. We got a, a whole bunch of solid spotted bass over on Africa. Trying to catch the legendary gold scene here on Golden Ridge. He's not being as cooperative as the spotted bass were. Looking around, no sign of him. I can't imagine they made legendaries dependent on time of day. That would just be an annoying thing to do. Probably hiding under your boat. Might be hiding under somebody's boat, but he ain't under mine. If he's under mine, he's dead on land. Have you ever saltwater fished? I haven't, actually. He won't bite, being stubborn. He's just a big, dominant male like that. It always amazes me that people find him to begin with. I realize there's sort of like limited spawn spots. <laughs> Looked like Noopy was about a capsize there. <laughs> Let me look at this. Most people caught him closer to like the side Kyla's on. Can't get to that rock. I don't think people fish for turtles. I mean, I have seen turtles being caught, but I don't know if the intention was to catch them. Rib Goldstein 2023 2024. Yep, he's dead. Sad time, really. Huh? I know. Turtle's actually pretty good. I've never, never tried it. A Goldstein fish. So you found him over there. The thing about it is, it's client side, so me going over there doesn't really mean anything, but I'll still try. Should I park my boat right in front of Kyla? There's a fish over here. I can't imagine he's in here. That's what, like, the vast majority of the posts I'm seeing are from the shore. Alright, well. I'll let him snap you off. Noofy said, watch out, I'm catching gold <laughs> Quite the sound is happening right now. I hope that sound lasts forever. I'm definitely not staying right here. That's definitely something they gotta fix. Oh, now mine's broken. Good job. Can you use live bait? Yes. Yeah, it's a little annoying. 
What's up, Aaron? Hey, thank you, Rab. I appreciate that, man. Uh, now that boat sound is not only still happening, but it's cutting in and out. That's quite a song it's playing. That's good. Just trying to find a place that is not going to ruin eardrums. Has who just not noticed? Oh my god. Is that your boat big no, it's Snoopy's, I think. I'm getting too close and it's causing that. Oh, those two just left. I saw that. Snoopy's still there for you, so I think it was just those two leaving. Boat's breaking down. It's it's something. Multiple legendaries per session? Everything's client side, so like in theory, Kylo can hook into him and I can hook into him at the same time, but everybody can catch him. What's up, winners? Been good, man. Kylo just got Goldstein, so, you know, she has the diamond spotted bass today and the legendary. I have three gold spotted bass. You got him, Newfie? Nice. So that's the spot to be. All right, I'll let you catch him then, because I don't want to get in your way. I gotta go to the bathroom anyway, so I'll be right back. In the same area that I'm at. All right, well I'll be right back then, and we'll see. I'll leave the mic unmuted in case Kyla wants to scream across the room. I said I'll leave the mic unmuted in case you want to scream across the room. Up to you. Give me RB. Oh, what is the game audio doing? Why does it sound like that? Is it going to change if I move? I might need to join another session. Because we're... We're definitely not dealing with it. Okay, shouldn't have done that when the game was lagging. That was horribly laggy. What's up, Clayton? Super laggy for me right now. I think the angle is about to crash. Uh huh? 
Mine was at 60 FPS, but trying to load back into the menu was just broken. I also don't have any menu sounds, so I maybe needed to close. Oh, that works. What well, would have put me back there? Huh? Oh. That's right, I'm gonna catch him first, cast. Can I get to that rock? And no. Hey, Silver Moon. Got my first diamond moose on Layton. There you go, man. Congrats. We need one thick bass to bite. Time's going super speed because I see shadows moving. Did you catch a movie? Nice. Saw a bass, but that wasn't Goldstein. Oh, hi. I wanted to get to this rock so I could, like, see better, but... Yeah, that's where I was casting, but... Or really where I did cast. I'm pretty sure I cast it one time. Yeah, it might be better to catch him not there, but if that's where he's spawning, then it sort of is what it is. Caught a diamond bass today. Nice. Large mouth or spotted small mouth? Think about bored of holding control to use the popper. What time is it supposed to be in this server? Because it's... This feels like morning to me, like it was going backwards. Yeah, it is. I guess I can live with morning. Sure would be kind if he'd bite. Kind? Nice? I don't know. Shadow's working on her antler bone, if you hear that. Why doesn't he like me, though? Snowfish in this game like me. I don't know why I even asked that question. Did you see him or just catch him? Did you know that empty beer cans are empty? Really hope they can push out the time switching update? That and fixes to the audio stuff would be great. I still think they need to limit like how often you can switch time, but walleye. I thought that was a big bass. I was like, well. It's a funny looking bass you got there. I was playing a fishing planet and spent all my money going to different maps. Yeah, the way that works is kind of annoying. But they're sort of one of those free to play games designed to cost money. The golden loin. Oh dear. I'm pretty sure they like kind of swim. I don't know if it's in circles, but they have a radius that they can 
sort of swim around. Nice. It would be really nice if he'd swim past my lure. For the angler, less money needed, that is for sure. Isn't there like several thousand dollars worth of uh, Fishing Planet DLCs if you bought them all? What's up, Donovan? Deer loan sounds good right now. I bet you didn't mean loan. Just surface, man. No, we can go after Henrik. I already caught Goldstein. Uh huh. Goldstein's easy too. No, it's not. It's supposed to be. <laughs> I'm just enjoying quoting you, and you've had enough beers that you're not mad at me. <laughs> Why does my controller shock my hands when I'm fighting a fish? Isn't that what happens when you fish in real life? I know I get attacked by the fish. Need a jitterbug? Surprised they don't have any. Maybe maybe because the water disturbance. Although we're using poppers and they don't make water disturbance. Jitterbugs and uh What are them buzz baits? I like how I know so many people caught them next to the shore. But then I'm not catching them next to the shore, so I just yeet a cast out in the middle of this. Level 16, what fish should I go after? So the XP and stuff you gain is based on weight. I'd probably try to catch, like, pike or something that can be decent size, but, you know, most of the ones you're going to catch, you can reel in in a couple of minutes. Try to level up and get some better gear. That's the approach I would take. Later, Maximus. Appreciate you hanging out. I think he's not real. You guys hacked him into April Fool's me. Let's me have this rock. I'm sure this won't inevitably be a problem when there's rocks all in the way. I like how the first thing you caught was a gold and now you're catching bronzes on that. Small. It's because I'm using a 2 op. I only target the biggest of males. He can't be in there. Can he? I guess we'll try. What's up, Hunter Man? New catfish set up arrived today. Now I just need time to actually use it. Yeah, look at that. 12 pounds, not bad. Are the. <laughs> it's not a boulder, it's a rock. <laughs> Are the burbot sizes the same on this map as. Um, Wherever, Norway. I heard a splash, I don't know where it was. The one thing about going to a like the same place Kyle caught him on another server. For one, again, it's client size. So I don't know if it matters. But especially being on another. Took you 50 minutes to even see him. I don't think we're going to spend that long. I'm hoping we just happen to cast close enough to him that he comes and hits this eventually. Like, it's not deep water. So it's not as if we're going to bring it over him and he's not going to come hit it. 
like, is not, he doesn't just surface, he jumps out of the water. Oh, was that him? That was pretty big. I'll go slow on this. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Kyla just got a monster. Not hitting this. Maybe it wasn't him. That or I didn't. That has to be. Let me scoot closer. Yeah. I know I say that sanctious. Is that correct? Thank you for subscribing. Welcome, welcome. Big make. Big make. I don't think I marked the right spot. That's annoying. Like, I feel like we actually have to be around the other side to catch at least whatever that was. The odds that the same fish jumped in the same spot that wasn't a legendary that just, like, coded to jump is pretty unlikely. Try a smaller hook? Uh, two out will work for Goldstein. That shouldn't matter. Now watch, he's never gonna surface again. Felt like it was kind of straight out from here. I'm gonna go with a fairly fast retrieval so that we can cover some water. Are we able to go ice fishing in this game? At least not currently. I'd like to see that fish again if it wasn't him, because I'll, I'll put the five popper on and try to catch it. It looked like a big one. Was it that? That didn't look as big. Let's see if we catch whatever that is anyway. Haven't caught a fish in so long. What should I kill it with? Um, what about? Alright, Kyla says shoot it in the neck with the 243 pistol. Tried a bigger hook, got nothing, then switched to a 2, got him right away. Might have been coincidence, but it worked. Well, I can tell you this 5 isn't working. I saw that go over there. I'm guessing that's the big one I saw then? Standing right in the water, but he looks nice. Can I please land my fish? That looks weird. Huh? No, they look like they're sprayed with uh, shellac. What's up, Mel? Stream dying? Not on this end. Nah, everything's fine. We haven't dropped any frames or anything. The hunter's also good. It could be YouTube's end, but everything's smooth here. Smooth as the glossy coating those bass seem to have. Well now, the excitement that I thought I saw, I'm pretty sure that wasn't him. <laughs> five by five here? Wait, what? See, that looked like him again, I swear. That's his animation. Isn't it? Am I losing my mind? Huh? Why not?
According to Google, this is a PG stream. It is. Because Kyla doesn't have a mic on. Yeah, you guys couldn't hear, hear her say that, but... So I did finally get to sleep and have awoken with a huge headache. That's what we're looking for. Like Big man. I still have the five popper, so like, even if that was a decent... That's him, is it not? Like, hit the lore, sir. That is then what's going on? I have a five on. Why would he want a five? I don't know. <laughs> two out wasn't working. Two. I don't have a two. I have a five and I have a two on. What, what are you attempting to catch? A will to live. <laughs> Goldstein. Listen, sir. If you don't hit this, I'm coming in there after you with a shotgun. Hello? I did cut the line. That's not even close to where he is. Do you know where he, swims? he can't have gone that far. I saw him like six times here. Sir. Hello. How shotgun DLC? You have to be really rich. You having beers tempting me? Dollar Jenny. <laughs> Dollar Genesee, as they say in PA. Stop moving. Maybe that's the problem. I'm pretty sure he'll hit a five, by the way. I think seven's like the smallest he'll hit. And I brought it right past him. That's becoming clear, yeah. Will he hit a red worm? Popper frog, crankbait, spinnerbait. Oh, he won't. Watch out for pike? Yeah, I just caught one. If I catch a pike on a two out, it'll be a nice one. Does twitching matter? Uh, I need to be with the popper. Popper's on the list of the, the main things he likes to hit. I heard a fish jump to the left. Could he have moved over there? Probably. That's worth a try because I've been going through here. Use a creek chub? Good idea. I hear those are really good bass bait, though. That wasn't him. I saw a fish over there. I swear, if he jumped right in front of me, I'm not going to catch him. Uh, well, yeah, that's the thing, like... It'd be one thing if I just couldn't find him. But for him to just absolutely reject me like that. It wasn't appreciated. I saw a fish swim away, but that can't have been him. Guess we'll stay in this area. Listen to the wife. <laughs> Especially when it comes to fishing, apparently. Yeah. I might try a big swim bait, just because you can do a constant retrieval, and I can stop having, like, my entire hand on the control key so that I can have the twitching technique. That 
wasn't him. The only good thing about this spot, other than the fact that it seemed he was here, we can see the vast majority of this area. So, like, if he surfaces, it's probably on screen. Uh, not that swim bait. Did I put the other one away? Dang it. What's the... What, what, what else he hit? Popper frog, crankbait, spinnerbait, worm, grub, shad tube. So... I don't think I have a big one of any of those, actually. Guess we get to keep the popper. That wasn't him. He has that, like, vertical... There's a fish. Anyway, his jumping animation's different. Where can I post art in the Discord? Just the general pictures channel. I didn't mean to. I meant to be doing four. I'll see him though. You know? Yeah, but you hooked him pretty far away. I don't think speed can spook him. Should you do a roadier grind for a super rare piebald? I'm not really into grinding for a super rare personally. Like, I don't know. There's something about super rares that I don't... Not that I haven't killed them from a grind. But I want... I want to find them as like a chance encounter. Not something where that's the end goal. Later, Clayton. You've probably already gone. I just saw that. What bait? Uh, we Did he just jump behind that rock? I thought I saw something. We have a two-up popper right now. No, that was a small fish. No. It's getting long enough since I've seen him that it's probably worth going and getting the boat to move a little bit. I still want to be right here. But I... That's a big pike. Did you get a super rare in 2023? I don't think I had one in 22 or 23. Did I? I don't know if my last super rare is the Pieball Diamond Gray Fox, but that's the last I can remember. Where's my boat? We'll bring it over here. No. Stay off my boat. I'm going to ban you from my boat. I'm going to capsize it and send you into the deep end. Mel still on my super rares? Not wrong. I'm trying to like <laughs> use my left hand to run so I can take a drink. Oh, you poor thing. You must still be fishing for Goldstein. You didn't catch him though because my game hates me. You learned that today. Are you doing the block tail comp? I haven't entered it. <laughs> Just like the the uh, expressionless look you have. Bye. Oh, it put me in the boat. rock was I at? Is it that one? I think so. You better show up. Or I'm gonna rage. Thanks. I was sort of hoping he might just surface and make my life easy. Of course, he'd surfaced before, and for some reason that didn't matter. No girls in the boat? I know. There's cooties in here now. 
Uh, gonna send a message after this one asking what to shoot it with, then say 243 next shot like others, so I can make a TikTok edit from it, say okay to confirm. You can go back in the VOD and get it too if you want me to, it's gonna, it'll sound less authentic, I guess. What's up, K-Flow? Yeah, we're trying to catch Goldstein. We literally saw him, like, he, imagine, like, he was in the path that our lore was on, and for some reason he didn't bite. Meanwhile, Kyla and uh, Nufi, who was here earlier, they both caught him, no problem. How many drinks? Three. It's kind of slow, because, like, when I'm at least fishing like this, I need to uh, do it with two hands. I gotta use my left hand to do the twitching thing. The Hunter Bros, thank you for subscribing. Get your fishing rod out of here. That's what I thought. Can barely hear Kyla in the background. Hello? She didn't want to be on the mic, so here we are. A non-tip fish. Oh, you missed it, Mel. I killed a non-tip in last night's stream. <laughs> uh, sure do, K-Flow. I caught, I caught three gold spotted bass, so I thought I was pretty good. And then Kyla caught a diamond one, and she caught gold scene. Here we are. Here we are. Waiting on you. You can go catch the other legendaries at any given time. Was that him out there? I don't think so, but I wasn't looking. Look. Straight ahead. Okay. Do you think he'll spawn if I dump some Miller Light in the water? Just pee in the water? Isn't that illegal? Was it big? Uh, 360... No, I think it was 168 or something. Yeah, it surely was not like Kyla's. She still hasn't put that thing in her lodge yet, by the way. Psychopath behavior, if I've ever seen it. What server am I in? How do I answer that? That's the best thing you can do with Miller? There are so many worse options than Miller, though. Like, my brother drank Bush Light for a while. I think he drinks the Yingling now. Bush Light, Genesee, Keystone, like, they're all straight dishwater to me. Miller's fine. I feel like Miller, uh... Bud Light's for pretty distinct. Miller, what is the one I'm trying to think of? Michelob and Coors are all on a fairly level playing field. There you go, Silver. Likes that Coors Light Banquet? Isn't that the one, those are the ones Ben Roethlisberger drinks on his podcast. I feel like I saw a big fish out there. It was like a ripple that I saw way in the distance, though. Yeah, I don't know if it could have been him or not. I sort of just hope he jumps out of the water if it's going to be him. I'm actually, like, a little bit salty that he didn't bite. While I'm waiting... So I'm just going to sit here. Connection successful. Uh, we might be back. I don't know what that was. Yeah, that was me. If you refresh or tell people to refresh, it should be good. Oh, it did? I didn't know it did refresh on its own. I don't know what that little blip was. Mothman? Maybe he was in PA. All right. Well, now I will check the resource hub. Let me catch him for you. Get out of here. Let me do it. No. What even? They changed. I guess I want the help sheet. 
so. Goldstein says, yeah, he'll hit on a size five. So like, why did he not hit the popper that I pot, that I pot, pot right past him? <laughs> What's up, Buzzing flaunted? Eh, not really. Can I get the moonshine? No. Robot mode? Just temporarily. Tell me about it. I'm, put a, I'm about to put a size 5 back on just to catch something. But again, he's supposed to be able to hit a size 5. So, like, why didn't he when I brought it right by him? That wasn't him. I'm still perplexed as to what happened. It's a small bass. That one looked okay, but it's not him. Hey, bite this. Try steel reserve? What does that even mean? What? Oh. I'm so thinking Golden Ridge Reserve, I thought that was some kind of joke about like that bridge or something. Sure is pretty where you're at? Yeah, at least the visuals are nice. Golden Ridge generally is a really nice map, though. By the way, do you notice how I caught that silver as soon as I saw it? Take notes, Goldstein. You jerk. No comment. How's the bite? Uh, I mean, it hasn't been bad today, but for whatever reason, Goldstein just refuses. Like, I literally watched him surface in front of me, brought the lure right past him, and he just didn't hit it for some reason. That was 20 minutes ago. Now he's gone. Like, back where you caught him at? I was think oh, I'm on one speed. I was thinking about going back there. I tried. Is this definitely where I was? Like this is where I was when I was on the shore and saw him. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Saw my lure and swam away? I mean, <laughs> that feels like what happens when I play this game. But I didn't, like, cast right on top of him and spook him. I had already cast it when he surfaced. So just in case, I know that's not what you were saying. I realized the meme you were going for, but just in case anybody, like, oh, hello. Anybody read it that way? That's not what happened either? Reeling Sim looks awesome. Listen, Dilly. I'm going to shoot all the pasture grizzlies in your county. You're never going to get one again. I scare the fish. These large goo bass are all over the place. Where's the legendary one? I guess I'll try this side. I think I cast it over there already. You can't do this to me. The pizza treatment. <laughs> yeah, we'll have a we'll hold a vote to see if he gets banned or not. You're crappy fishing. Oh, Admiral Axe got him over there. What? Yeah. 
That's what I'm saying, it's client side. So like, the fact that you and Nufi caught him in the same place is quite the coincidence, because he can spawn like literally anywhere, not literally anywhere, but in the vicinity, he can be anywhere for anyone. But yet, I saw him over here. I used to try it that way with legendaries, Sidewinder specifically, and that never worked. I don't know, like, I guess we could try it here. Hey, Preston. Appreciate you jumping in. Hopefully we can hook into gold scene here sooner rather than later. I'm at the point where I feel like I have to try to catch him. Did it start a new stream on YouTube, by the way, or did it keep the same one? I said, did it start a new stream on YouTube, or did it keep the same one? I'm hoping it kept the same one. It's really... That was him, right? Oh, maybe that was your fish. Did you have a bass? Oh, no. Oh, I thought you were paused. Oh, it jumped vertically like uh, Goldstein does. I wasn't look. I was looking at chat, but I saw that vertical jump. <laughs> Had him on twice, but he snapped the line. He's tough, man. Surprised you haven't put a shad on yet? Does, I, did they even hit shad? I don't even think I have one on me. I don't know what that was. Well... I guess we'll try scooting out into the water a little bit further. What rod do I need to catch him? I mean, you can catch him with pretty light equipment if you're careful. You just have to really work your drag and pump to wear him out. There's not, like, a specific rod that's the cutoff, necessarily. Is Goldstein related to Einstein? Yeah, that's... Totally. Thinking about downloading the Angler. How is it? Uh, I don't play much Call of Duty anymore. I mainly play Way the Hunter. I, w I Like, I would kind of relate it to the Call of Duty fishing games. You're going to catch a lot of fish. Unless you're doing what I'm doing, like, targeting a legendary, in which... I'm using a lore that, well, I just switched back, but I'm using a lore that only the legendary is going to hit, in theory. So, like, I'm not going to catch as many that way. You're going to catch a lot of fish. You're going to be able to catch a lot of decent fish. Diamonds in this game are far more rare than in the Hunter Call of the Wild, in my opinion. It's not more rare, necessarily, when everybody understands how to get them. But, like, if you're just a... If you're just randomly going out and not using, like, hotspot guys or anything like that. Uh, ours starts, Deb, in May 4th. It is absurdly late this year. But I am going to Kentucky next week. So, am I ready? No. <laughs> I got a lot of stuff I gotta get done before then. Am I excited? Extremely. How about yours? Is yours going yet? I think he saw my lure and died. <laughs> Told you he's looking sickly earlier. I think that's what happened. Oh, you live in Kentucky. Like, uh, Moorhead area? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> the way this is going. <laughs> Give me, like, four more. <laughs> Mel is a trophy fisher confirmed. No worries, Preston. It unfortunately just stopped being free on Epic like three or four days ago. Eh, maybe a week ago. What'd you say? Pretty much. 
four hours. Went scouting the day, found a couple roosted. We reserved a campsite uh, in that area. I don't even, to be fair, I didn't do the campsite reservation. Bottom Boy did, so he knows exactly where it is. I don't even know. I couldn't put, pinpoint on a map right now where we're going to be. But um, when we... When he <laughs> called, uh, the lady was like, Oh, are you the group from last year? Which we are not. So I guess the good news is at least people turkey hunt in that area, which theoretically means there should be birds there. It's going to be tough. Like, it's just going to be a weekend hunt. Uh, Aaron's coming with us, too. He's an echocardiologist, I think, so he can't get a lot of time off. So it's basically going to be a weekend thing. We're going to hope we can put one to roost and I would say to a large degree, get lucky. Got a diamond cutthroat today. Nice. <laughs> Mel, I have an idea for merch. Angle. 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 Reminds me of that uh, diabetes guy. Diabetes. 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 I think this is where Kyla caught him originally, so we're gonna try here again. I would enjoy that on a shirt. Watch LFG's video on baits yesterday? Literally heard a turkey and yelp mouth called him into like 40 yards. I've only done stuff like that, like in the summer and stuff. In the spring, I can be as good of a caller as I want, and it just never works well. What's up, David? Uh, some gold spotted bass. We're trying to catch gold scene. He's just not cooperating. Kyla caught him. Newfie caught him. He was in here earlier. I saw him surface right in front of me, and I... I don't know. He didn't hit for whatever reason. Designated color, there you go. I think that's... Well, I don't know. Bottom Boy's not getting a license. He's just gonna, like, come to hang out and film and stuff. Disconnected again. That's so weird. Like, it's only for a second and then coming back. I don't know if it's the bad internet coming back or if it's just YouTube not liking me. Maybe Goldstein's doing it. Appreciate you, happy man. Mothman eating internet at Denny's? Maybe that's it. It's alive. Blame Mel? Yeah, Mel had her big males quote and YouTube just said absolutely not. Is Biscuit World good? I can't remember if it was when I was... Maybe when I was driving us to Georgia? We saw it in a couple of places and I asked Kyla if it was good and she said she hadn't had it. If you got a fish as often as you disconnect, the boat would be full. Listen, Pixel. <laughs> that was rude, man. Your water bottle. Bottle of water. It's a bike. One hour left on my daily challenges. Did I do them all already? No, I did. Oh, there's. Wait, what? Oh, I didn't know they were separate from map to map. Boy, I'm dumb. Well, let me just activate a couple. They won't take me very long. And I'll go back to uh, size 5 for now, and if we catch him, we catch him. I clipped her laughing? What? 
What'd you do? M&M's, no! Can I get some gramps? Yeah, here, back here, my These waters were full of fish. We were pulling 43 pound Goldsteins out of here. <laughs> Left and right. That didn't make any sense. There are these kids skating on the sidewalk. Dynamite fishing. Yeah, you'll be lucky if you catch a shrimp. No! Go away. Go eat your M&Ms. <laughs> she asked if she could catch him on my account, by the way. Whoa! Hello. A poik! No. I, I saw there was an hour left on the dailies, and here I am. The perplexing part is, like, I've been using this thing a bit. And you can catch a four-pound bronze pike on it. And even that, like, I'm not getting a bite every cast. I guarantee there's so many four-pound pike around. That's Biden, not Gramps? I don't think I can do a good Biden. Something, something, corn pop. And then fall up a flight of stairs. Do you play Fishing Planet? I have like 20-something minutes in it. Don't think I can handle a 24-hour stream. You joined, so you're here for it. And so is everybody else. No one's allowed to leave until Gold's team bites. I'm not going to even be fooled by the fact that this thing went big. Hey! I'm good at the game. Listen. I need to buy a tackle box expansion, and I actually don't know what requirements I need next, but I don't want to do it on Africa because I want to buy the rod and I have like all the things other than legendary tokens. I might need one more diamond yet, but uh, more golds here will help. Stream until a gold boy is caught? I mean, that's my current plan, but at some point, unless, you know, we actually catch him, I'm going to have to change those plans. Especially given two disconnects in the last 20 minutes. Just destroyed my line, stood no chance. I hate it when that happens. The first couple times I try to catch Big Larry, that happened to me. What did somebody tell me they call Big Larry? Because it's actually a female fish. They they specifically have it in the data entry. Big Larietta is what somebody calls her. Next fish, Kona now? If you do that like 15 more times, you're going to be right on one of them. Big Linda. I had a... When I worked at the uh, college dining hall, we did... Or they did... Catering for like pretty big events. That I forget who it was. But it, it might have been one of Joe Green or Franco Harris. It was one of the... 70 Steelers, like prominent 70 Steelers. Uh, his daughter got married in that area, and I wasn't a part of this particular catering event, but they catered that. Like, it, it was some fairly fancy stuff. But anyway, um, we had a, a boss named Lisa, and her personality would have fit Big Lisa instead of Big Linda. She was like... She had that personality where, like, it just made you listen. Is what I'm getting at. Love pike fishing IRL. They're little kamikazes. I literally had one hit my spoon as it was dangling off the side of my kayak while I was releasing another one. <laughs> nice. We tried to catch him in Deep Creek, Maryland. My brother caught one. And that was it. We didn't get a single hit from anything else the entire time. And then we had the thing on the dock for like 15 minutes trying to figure out how to untangle it from the net. Larry's spot was pretty easy last week. He had nowhere to run. That's the ideal situation for like newer players with like lighter equipment. I'm hoping 
Sidewinder spawns in a good place. Get your fishing rod out of here. Uh, is that going to be next week now? I'm not going to... Oh, no, I will be here. I'll be fine. I really want to catch Sidewinder. What? He, I don't know how, but it covered like a quarter of the screen. <laughs> like a uh, yeah, because the uh, the disconnects have like it, I think it records the part that isn't streamed when it's disconnected, and then it plays that back. I'm telling you, he's not real. I'm like beginning to wonder if that was a pike or something. No, it wasn't. It was definitely him? It was him. So like what happened? Why didn't he bite? These bronze pikes are not really helping my dailies. So I still need three more silvers. I was thinking about like going into single player or something just to get into another session and like have them in another area. It's a nice pike. Too bad he's not by that bridge. Because you can get up on the bridge and you can see into the water so well. You're still alive? Haven't died yet. If Goldstein doesn't bite, I might die. Apparently till he catches Goldstein. I like the apparently. <laughs> I think that's him. No? It sounded like it was gonna pull line. He will never catch him? You might be right. Is this a poik or a bass? It's not behaving super bass-like, but that's what it is. Close to gold. That pike looks really weird from this angle. Huh? I mean, it looks really weird. Be awesome since I was so late. The rate we're going. Who knows? Get him in six more cast? Boy, that would be a dream. I forget exact. Well, no, I'm going to try to catch two more silver largemouths anyway. There's a pike again. I forget exactly how it went down, but I was trying to catch Sidewinder the one week. And I really can't remember why I was up, like, stupid early. But I was up at, like, 5 or 6 in the morning. It was still completely dark out. And, uh... I was like, what the heck? I'm gonna, I'm gonna spend my time and try to catch him. And I just remember, like, watching the sun come up. And I'm just casting over and over and over, trying to catch this stupid fish. And I never... got so much as a nibble. The entire, like, four hours. I don't know if it turns your character winners. You can turn now for uh, the trophy shot mode. But I'm not sure if it turns like just your like the client side or not. It's a big pike. Not like high metal or anything, but later Carson. Gold pike? Not a chance. Like, eight pounds. Maybe nine. Eh, ten. Or is it Linda? Linda! I need help with burger of the day. 
I don't think I do a good Bob. Can you show me a good pike spot? I think the dam is the best place for them. That would be... Stop. I don't know why it's doing that. That would be... Is it here? Yeah. Like down in this area? What's up, Left on Open? How's it going, man? Long time no see. Been all uh, 24 hours. Pike sim. The turnpike sim. Gonna try to catch a diamond eel before you catch Goldstein. I, I appreciate the confidence. <laughs> I guess we're gonna go back over kind of where we saw him initially. See if he shows back up. Turnpike Troubadour. Is that, yeah, that's the name of my stream team. was I think this was the rock I saw him by or wait yeah oh can you not aww I thought you could like fish from here <laughs> I wanted to be up high so I could see him dang it man this game sucks <laughs> I thought it was a great idea. See you later. What's up, Will? Thank you for subscribing. Appreciate it, man. 12 out of 10 boat landing. I mean, it really was exactly what I wanted to do. It just, I didn't know you couldn't fish like that. Uh, Glixy, thank you for subscribing as well. What's up, Shio? It's Bob's Burgers. I used to be able to do a much better Bob's Burgers Bob impression. Bob Belcher it is. Did I hear earlier Kyla had M&Ms? They're all gone now, but yeah. Boating by Flantro. They don't call me the captain for nothing. Wait a minute. I just realized. If we use the pink boat, we're guaranteed to catch him. Plain or peanut? Plain, I think. They'd be peanut if you bought them. Come here, personless boat. Oh, that's you. Where are you going? All right, see ya. You ever caught a dorkfish? I've caught horny head chubs before, yeah. I gotta finish this beer and open another one. The worst part about that is my headset likes to fall off, so I have to hold my headset on with one hand. It looks really dumb. Hazelnut M&Ms? Those exist? Nutella? Huh? I thought it was chocolate. What's hazelnut? What's hazelnut made out of? <laughs> Hazelnuts, I think. What's Nutella made out of? It's like hazelnut spread? I thought it was just chocolate this whole time. I've never had it, actually. To be fair. What are they selling? <laughs> chocolate! They're selling chocolate! Chocolate. I remember when they first invented <laughs> I don't know if it's just in my ears, but that sounds really good to me. I always hated it! <laughs> That's what this stream has become, huh? Oh, yeah. Sweet, sweet chocolate. Going <laughs> insane. 
<laughs> sweet, sweet Goldstein. <laughs> I remember when they first released Legendaries. <laughs> Man's really likes his chocolate. Time to go to sleep, old man. <laughs> hey, Becky, my day. These kids had enough respect to keep their thoughts to themselves. Now, there's social media are posting on the face tube. Something about status updates, I tell you. There's not too many streams, Silver Moon, where I don't do some type of SpongeBob impression. The last stream, uh, Monday stream, was, uh, had an actual clip of SpongeBob saying April Fool's to me. Sure would be good if he'd surface again. Times so we have to teach you this lesson, old man. I love the young people. You didn't do challenges? The face tube? That's what it is. How long was this stream supposed to be? I mean, it was going to be a longer stream, but... Huh? Oh. I was figuring around 10 p.m. we'd end, and we're past that now. Man Ray impressions. I can't think of what he sounds like, and it's funny. Oh. Well, I can think of him saying, like, then take it. It's not my wallet. That's about it. <laughs> this must be your wallet. That makes sense to me. You might be onto something there, Blake. You might be onto something. Ten PM PST PTSD maybe. Not a bad start, Matthew. Like I feel like we're reaching most of this entire little inlet, and we still can't get him to bite. Does Goldstein even exist? Nah, I'm pretty sure the, those guys hacked him in, dude. April fools me. Dude, I thought that about the block tail, Dilly. Because I hadn't actually seen anybody that killed one. And I was like, there's no way they're April foolsing us by telling us there's something in the game that's not actually in the game. But I was beginning to wonder. Oh, brother, this guy stinks. I'm seriously not very far from going into, like, single player or another server just in the interest of trying to get him to spawn somewhere different. Why? Kyla says she hopes we never catch him. I do want to leave you, because you just steal Goldstein, and I don't even get a chance. I'll steal him? Yep. This, realistically, this is your fault. You should have fished where I was. You were there. You were right next to me. I'm not like the average PA fisherman, okay? You need to be next to me. Good luck. Good luck. What do you think your next Call of the Wild stream is? I think tomorrow's Twitch stream is going to be Call of the Wild. That's the current plan. Looks like kind of big ripples over there, but I don't have any reason to think that was him.
Is 6x too fast? Like, is it reasonable to just yeet this thing through the water in a bunch of spots? Hope for the best. Feed him more Mountain Dew and pepperoni rolls? Oh, Mothman? I didn't know who you were feeding Mountain Dew and pepperoni rolls. <laughs> Giving up on eels? Giving up sounds like a good idea. As for the last resort, yeah, it didn't seem like it was working. Something surfaced. Thinking it might be time to start working the shore again, because that's at least where we saw him. And I guess we'll start where that guy caught him at. Hey, right, this, uh, I didn't even know Way Zone was here. Hope he doesn't judge me for my pink boat. I'll never be seaworthy again. At least the music helps. I can't hear the music, so. I'll only face the music. Ever fished Racetown? I actually haven't. Played Call of the Wild for about seven hours and thought I've only been playing for an hour? Time can fly. It happens. Like when you're trying to catch a stupid legendary fish. Catches him in 12 inches of water. What did you catch him on? Was it a popper? So like, why doesn't he like mine? Have you watched Marvel movies? Like, other than like by accident or just, you know, walking through... A room where one might be on now. That's what I meant by by accident. That was a really weird phrase. He's more than legendary. He's fabled. I think he's non-existent. But, you know, we can agree to disagree on terms. That's fine. The worst thing is, like, I'm facing this way and I heard a fish jump on my right. Could that have been him? Very well could have. Will I ever know? Probably not. Are you near Racetown, Pixel? I know at some point you told me where you were because there was that uh, conversation about meeting up at the Pittsburgh airport but I don't remember now ghost fish accurate we get doc from classic to help us out hey uh, I was disguised as a mushroom and I saw you couldn't catch that fish I've decided to penalize you 12 EMs. Oh, that's it there. I read it as here, Pixel. Don't mind me. Delusional from lack of fish. My Omega 3s are low. What's your top three non hunting or fishing games of all time? Is Red Dead a hunting or fishing game? Like, it has hunting and fishing in it. Like, personally, I think Subnautica is one of the best games. It's one of the best games I've ever played. So I'm going to say, like, Red Dead, Subnautica, Red Dead 2, that is. And... Be my third. Like... Oh, there he is. 
12 years later. Don't snap my line, you absolute jerk. The best part is, he's not far from where I was casting the entire time. I'm gonna just turn my drag down. The old Flantro Subnautica streams? Dude, I, uh, not very long ago, I played through it on hardcore mode and finally beat the game on hardcore, which is a mo like a, a dream I've had from the time I first started playing. You crashed? Boy, I sure hope I crashed with the gold scene on the line. Wouldn't that be good? I'll come up with my third game as we reel them in. I'm trying to tire them out right now. Um. Oh, I was going to say, like, the Gen 3 of Pokemon. So, like, any of Leaf Green, Fire Red, Sapphire, Emerald, Ruby. That was, like, peak Pokemon, in my opinion. I don't think it ever got better. I, I have Brilliant Diamond on my Switch right now. When I eventually play through that, well, I've beaten the main game, but when I'm done with the post game, I'm 100%, woo, that was a little bit much. I'm 100% getting a, uh, a playthrough of, like, Leaf Green or something going again. First cast! <laughs> I'm so good at this game! As I've nearly let him snap me off twice. Why? Like, why is the tension that high? Is he just harder to catch than he used to be? No. It only took you like three minutes. Hey, thank you, Pam. Anxiety? Dude, if this was Braid, that was gone. Braid wouldn't have potentially gone as high tension. But braid snaps, fluorocarbon stretches. Like, I thought I learned that pumping is the way to tire out fish. And I should just do that. I think the old way I used to try to catch legendaries was better. I, I did, like, a lot of this. Like, keep high tension on the rod to tire them out. Oh, the audio's freaking out, too. I'm, I'm glad we get to deal with that. The video, it'll be first cast? Of course. Huh! There he is! Got him! This is easy! And then what I'll do too is like edit this and edit the timer on the screen to say like 12 seconds. Meanwhile, it's gonna actually be 12 minutes. Hope you guys enjoy this glitchy audio that's happening. How much line do you have? I think it's 286 feet or something on this reel. You can see he is getting tired though, like the tension's not going as high. The worst part is we gotta get him all the way into zero and then he's gonna run again. At least, that's how it used to work. Wonder how many beers I had when we first came to Golden Ridge. Because I'm at four or five now. Four. The audio is getting worse. I'm going to take my headset off. Watch it not be him? Nah, I saw him. I got Goldstein! I got Goldstein! Just ripping him through the water now, but he's gonna see us and then we get to do this again. Shout out to me for saying something and then he stopped immediately. Nice of me to glitch the... glitch? Jinx? That's what I meant. <laughs> it's a shark! Holy! His audio, though. Guess he felt... Yeah, it was a pity bite, really. We all know. He can't fool us. I'm gonna try to land him when we get him here, but I'm pretty sure it's just not happening. Yep. And no point getting over anxious about it. We'll just... Slowly bring the drag up till it... Kind of stops him. He's getting it, though. Let's try pumping a little bit at that. That's kind of working. Like, it's not... The game's not lagging, but this audio makes me feel like it's lagging, and it makes me feel like I have to be extra careful because my response time will be shortened by the fact that it is lagging. A 12-minute fight? It might be. 
It shouldn't be as bad as it's being, but I'm definitely being overly cautious because it took 12 years. Did you message Mel to say I suck at the angler? No. Oh. This is enough to make me mute the audio. Like, it's so bad. Oh, maybe the music covers it. Just straight audio. It's horrible. Oh dang, Matthew. I've never even... Never even caught a pike, so musky would be pretty cool. I think we're fairly safe to bring the... The drag up. I don't want to go too much here. Yeah... Yeah, I don't think I can go to 75 safely. Don't hear it. Can barely hear it. Alright, well that's encouraging because I'm telling you I'm suffering right now listening to this. Hi! Did I read that correctly or was it was that meant to be held for longer? And it sounds amazing. Just like DD33 intro. Hello everyone. This is the Hunter DD33 and today... We're catching Goldstein. Mel will say, did he finally get good? She's gonna be like, oh my god, he got him? I thought that idiot would never catch a fish again. <laughs> He's terrible. Sounds exactly like him. I pride myself on being able to apparently do a good impression of the old lady from the chocolate episode of Spongebob. An old man voice and Dee Dee 33 voice. Dee Dee's just my other personality. Some people think we're brothers. Like, I don't think we look or sound at all alike to have that assumption, but... There's been a number of comments over the years asking that. Come on. It's time to give up. And let me catch you. I don't know where you've been this entire time. But I don't appreciate it. I'm going to hold you out of the water until you die. But you don't have to know that. Nice. That's crazy. Can you hear that? That noise is poggers, something like that, yeah. I gotta get a good cut out of this for thumbnails. The biggest diamond bass I've ever caught. Where is my pink boat? There it is. Whee! Alright, Goldstein. We're slow dancing. He doesn't seem to find this as funny as I do. What is that noise? I don't know. It's broken. <laughs> I don't know how long we spent trying to catch him, but at, le <laughs> at least we actually did. It was an eight minute fight. Was it really? Like, I knew it took a while, but that's a long time. All right, you get to live this time. I'm getting out of the server right now. Well. I guess it's 10.30. I thought about maybe going to try to catch one of the other ones, but considering how that went, I think we're just going to wrap it up at this. I'll wait till this loads back because it lags if I try to do a transition. Do a little turn on the catwalk. Are we free? <laughs> no. We're going after Alejandro next. No. We're going we're gonna to wrap it up with that. That was fun. That was a good time. I don't know why we're still black screening. Maybe because the game was entirely borked there for like 10 minutes. If it ever loads back, that'd be great. <laughs> why? Jump scare! She's even looking around like, why did I do that? 
Appreciate it, winners. All right, I guess we're stuck here because nothing's happening. <laughs> Let me tab the steam. Okay, everything's laggy. Tab the steam. Just gonna close that. All right, we get a black screen now. But that oh, wrong screen. That's fine. It's basically the same. I think that's gonna do it for this one. Glad we got to do a stream tonight. Glad we finally got gold scene. Got some uh, gold tokens over in Africa. Shadow said no more stream. Yeah, time for bed, guys. Get off the computer. And uh, we'll, we shall see. We got tomorrow's stream. That's going to be back in Under Call of the Wild. Maybe we'll throw some angler on the end. See how we're feeling. Uh, looking forward to that. That'll be over on Twitch, 1 p.m. Eastern tomorrow. On that note, thank you guys for watching. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for all the support. And I'll see you in tomorrow's stream. Bye.